Are we good? Good morning. And welcome back to the show. We are back, baby, in full of friggin' force. Another day in the world of hardcore. Cover right up. We're going to have a glorious week of broadcasting. Oh, it feels good to be back. What do you mean, QFU? It's time to get him out of here. Get him out of here. First battle of the week's coming up. No, I'm not hungover today. No, absolutely not. I don't drink on Sundays ever. Oh, fuck that. I can't be asked to wait. Hi. Good morning. 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 You sure? I did have one yesterday. <laughs> Woo! Hey, love! Come on in! Let's go. If there's still room, can I have light blue wool, please? There is room. There is room. Thank you so much, Ayla, for the 22 months, 13 in a row. Nearly two years. Followed by M. Gale. It's just 33. Beautiful months. I will just leave this 33-year sub streak oh. 107 stream streak here along with this. Glue jam 1, glue jam 2, button judge Joe. And it is possible to get a lime wool near the ever-growing stash. Yeah, I know it's getting hard to it find is. a place now. Glue dance. It is. So you want a, a lime green wool and a light blue wool. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um... My dad was going to the pub on Sundays with his mates, going to church. Well, yeah, true. I mean, the next Sunday is acceptable because it's a bank holiday, but I'll be away on a work trip to Insomnia, which is Thursday. So we need to talk about a couple of things because there is actually news today, chat. So the first piece of news is as follows. Uh, Insomnia is on Thursday, it's the 28th, and it runs through to Monday. However, we have some stuff to talk about. Uh, we will be live during the Insomnia period. Um, we will be live during that. Won't be on the Thursday. The Thursday is just like getting there, setting up, and like that. So it won't be Thursday, which is usually my day off anyway, so that works out fine. However, Friday there should be a stream. Saturday there should be a stream. And then Sunday there probably won't be. I don't know. We'll see. However, we do have a couple things to talk about. The first one being, uh, some exciting news for the week after. Because I've been doing a little bit of research in preparation for if we hit a hundred streams streak in a row of hitting the bit goal. And I said we'd do a marathon. That marathon stream will be between Tuesday and Sunday. Somewhere in this gap. I don't know when. I haven't figured that out. It basically all depends on. Because insomnia sometimes has quite a detrimental effect on my voice. Because uh, I'm just talking to people all day for like four days. So, providing that's not the case and we're fine come Monday. It'll be pretty early on in this week. But if it isn't, and my voice is a bit sore, we'll probably give it a few days and then maybe do it Friday, Saturday sort of time. So, we'll see. Well, that's when that'll be. Um... But obviously that depends on if we hit the, the 100 stream streak, to be fair. But we piss it on me. We usually have one night where we have a few more beers than we probably should. But other than that, it's pretty chill. It's pretty chill. Um, that night for me will probably be Saturday because I've got the football. Uh, sorry, no, probably be Friday because of uh, the uh, creator party that I've got on the Friday night with Ubisoft. So, which is a free bar, which, you know, we're going to have to we're going to have to abuse that. Um, Hulls, oh, thank you for the 180 bits. Friday, Saturday, Saturday sounds great to me. Uh, looking forward to the marathon. Yes, should be good fun. Should we hit it? Should be good fun. Um, thank you for the 180 bits. The first biddies of the week. Pog. Big pog rooney Rubber duck. Oh, God. I didn't shut my mouth fully and water just went everywhere. And another 180. Thank you very much, Holes. Enjoy that number one spot on the leaderboard. 
Rubber Duck, thank you for the 23 months, mate. Almost two years. We're kicking off the week with a hype train, dear lord. Um, unfortunately, Cree, it's no plus once. I'm sorry, pal, but it is a free bar. Uh, will the insomnia streams count towards the streak? They will do. Um, I'll have to transfer the streak across, but that shouldn't be too much of an issue. Um, but yeah, they, they should do indeed. Kanga, thank you for the 100 bits, pal. Appreciate it. Uh, so I guess we'll cover that real quick as well. Uh, the bit leaderboard has reset. Hot Rod's reign of terror is over. Um, he took the, uh, the king spot from Rob right at the end of the week. How very mean of him. <laughs> um, but his reign of terror is over. And the bronze, silver, and gold badges are available to literally everybody. Um, what else said to talk about? Yes, 98 on the streak. Two away for the big 100 unlocking a marathon show. Uh, hopefully that'll be... Well, it will be before Insomnia if, if we... Uh, if we, if we are going to hit it, because it'll be today and tomorrow, and that's it. So, we shall see. Um, how long the street will continue after that, I don't know. That's all on, up to chat. We'll see. But maybe we'll set more milestones. <sighs> Who knows? The fact it's still going is just fucking ridiculous, to be honest with you. But there you go. I'm not complaining. I'm incredibly grateful for the support. It's insane. Absolutely insane. So, we shall see. Um, but and you missed my big news, by the way. 105 because you shared it during all the chaos. I can't see it during all the chaos. I don't have it as an alert thing over here. You have to wait until all the chaos has settled down from the morning. And then I can be like, whoa. But thank you for the 105. I appreciate that. That's that's pretty freaking crazy, bro. Um, right. So, I think that's everything. So, yeah. Insomnia is coming up on Thursday. We should stream. We will be streaming during it. Um, looking forward to the event. I am doing BYC. Somebody asked me. Um, the marathon streams will be after Insomnia, or the marathon stream will be after Insomnia. Um, and fishing streams should be returning next month, which is amazing. Um, Kev, thank you for the 100 bits. You'll take third while it's available. Enjoy, mate. Enjoy. Thank you for the 100 bitties. Already a tenth of the way on that gold pot. Thank you. Um, see you Thursday, the IRL button. Oh, great. Um, yay. Yay. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, you. It'll be good to see you, mate. It'll be good to see you. Um, wow. <laughs> um, right. Anyway, let's do some hellos. If you're out there, you're not lurking in the darkness. Please say hello in the chat. I should say hello there. Will it still be Minecraft doing this on me? Yeah. Yeah, it will. It will be. Uh, I'll take the world with me and back that up. Um, I should probably make a note of that, actually, because I will forget to do that. Uh, reminders. Um, create. Not great. Create backup of world for insomnia. Cool. Which will be, I don't know, Wednesday. I'll, I'll tell myself to do it Wednesday at 2 o'clock. Sure. Right, good morning to the following people. Holes, how are you? MK, good morning to you. Rubber Ducks in the house, good to see you, mate. Kanga, Brock, good to see you. Uh, Q of you, Krakovo, good to see you. Go with Guilty Joker, Aronic, Gavin, Kaz, good to see you. Tonzat. Um, Ayla, good morning to you. Uh, Irage, how are you, mate? Good to see you. Um, hey, Dad, long time I've seen you, Irage. How you been, bro? Um, Plasma, Zakona in the house, good to see you, buddy. MCZ, Blue Knight, Violet, Lodi. Caluminous good to see you. Cam, Don's here before she cries. I haven't said hello. Tall Paul, good to see you. Kate, how are you? Good morning, guys. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. So, without further ado, let's play some video games. That concludes the news. I think that's all the news today. 40 seconds left on the train, boys. That shit's out of here. Thank you for the uh, little bit of support on there. Appreciate it. Right. So, last stream. Um, oh, hang on. Let me catch up with blocks first. I'm going to do MKLs and... Uh, Ailers, which was a light blue wall and a lime wall, was it? Yes. Yeah. Annoyingly using the wall that I actually fucking need. Cheers, guys. Gee, thanks for that. Uh, okay. Let's do a light blue first. There's that one. Dun, 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 and then a lime green. Uh. 
Otis? IRL stream at Insomnia? Possibly. Uh, we did say about possibly going to one of the bars and having a, a few drinks with chat. Um, at some point. So we may do that. I think Imp's going to come along. It'll be me, Matt, and Imp sat there. If we can find time to do that, that'd be great. Um, God, MKL, this is... I mean, it's there. That's, that's it. <laughs> that's as close as I can get. Um, and then we've got uh, a lovely light blue here for Ayla as well, which will plonk right there. There you go. Thank you very much for the support, guys. It's coming along very nicely. The floor is nearly done, by the way. We've only got these few sections around the edge. We've only got the... This is all pretty full. It's just that section on the back edge, and then what's left under the, under the chest, and it's done. Uh, how many do you have left? I don't know. I would say there's maybe 20 max underneath that, maybe. So like 20, and then we've got like 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50, 50. There's, there's like just a, in the 50s, 52 or so left. Then the floor's done though. Um, however, this is what we did last stream. Operation Cow. We started building the head. Uh, whilst I was mildly, however. Um, but today we feel fresh. I haven't made a coffee this morning though, which is devastating. Uh, but the cow is on the way. Um, it is coming along nicely. It is coming along nicely, mountain cow. Uh, this side is just not done whatsoever. Um, whoop, get me up here. And then the head is finished. We've done the head, which is good. Uh, we've got Let's to do the underbelly, the wall, fun. and the arse. Glazed lime terracotta, please. Glue devil. Uh, there we go. Thank you for the 500 biddies. Taking us to the green mark. There it is. A fifth of the way. Cow is good, isn't it? Right, hold on. Let's uh, pull up over here. Uh, glazed lime terracotta. Okay, uh, where's that wood? I'll use that. There it is. Uh, there it is. Uh, I think we have one of these somewhere, MQ. I must admit, I hate to burst your bubble. I'm pretty sure we have one of these somewhere. I couldn't tell you where, but I'm pretty sure there is one. Nonetheless going right there. There you go, I'm cool. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Barton, first issue with Insomnia, my local fast chargers are broken, which means I'm slow charging at home. Mm. Not good. Not good. Is there not one on the way you can use it? Damn it! Is there not one you can grab on the way? Well, true Q of you, but most people that have electric cars do that. You just charge at home. Um, yeah, most people do that anyway. You just come in, you get home from work, whatever, you plug your car in, wake up next day, you've got 300 miles to use. Come home, plug it in, pops it back up again. And you just keep doing that. That's the way most people do it. I don't do it like that. And... That is it. You can do it that way. I dumbly thought that I would leave charging until today since tomorrow. So I wouldn't have enough to get anywhere else. God damn it. There you go. Your manager told you she gets paid £30 for parking at the NEC. Daylight robbery. That's why you park in the BYOC area. For free. Because they only do it on Thursdays and Fridays. And on Saturdays, there's nobody there. So you just pull in and just park up. You don't have to leave a ticket in the window or anything like that. And even if you do, they won't check it. You just pull up. Just pull in. Happy days. Um... There we go. So we've got a bit of war going on here. Uh, we have got to carry on with the cow here. But yeah, £30 to part at that place is just ridiculous. Um, it 
Let me do this here. Holy shit! Oh no. No, no, never mind. Kirsty! 54 months! You can't do that, you know, of course you can. The car park's open, there's no barrier stopping you going in, you just drive in. Kirsty, thank you for the 54, I appreciate it. Um, so we've got to crack on with this, we've done all this side. Now the other side of the car looks a bit like this, but the problem we have is, uh, this side was more detailed than this side, and we don't have another image of this sort of detail of the car. So we're just going to have to sort of make it up as we go along. Unless we just say bollocks to it. And just do everything out of light grey wall. Because you're not ever going to really see this side of the cow anyway. So I might just do that. Uh, and then we're good. We also need a picture of the underside of a cow. Um, because obviously there are going to be some udders involved. No, maybe you're just too paranoid to do it. It's all good. Don't worry about it. It's not for everybody. I know you're very much a... Strictly to the rules, law-abiding citizen. And bending them is not for you, I get it. Um, we do need some more brown terracotta, I believe, because we are completely out of that now. Uh, yeah, we're going to need a little bit more of that. Oh, shit, that's right! We needed more brown terracotta, which means I needed another beacon, which I didn't have because we fucking gave ours. Um... For the subfloor, wherever it is, here. And now I need another one. Paranoid? I just don't want to get fined and find out. Exactly. Because you're paranoid that you'll get fined. So you won't do it. Well, I got balls. Balls of steel. Thanks for that. You're welcome, Winston. Uh... We'll just get these. Come on, we need a skull. Ow. Are you kidding me? Right, skulls. I oh, know you're not coming anyway, Amy, so it doesn't matter. Don't worry about it. Uh, hello. Damn it! Right, game. I, we're not going to have a repeat of last stream. I need you to be kind to me and actually give me some wither skeletons here. Oops. I have these other ones. I can't believe how shitty the spawns have been at this other one as well, by the way. We've got all this open bridge section, which you'd think would be just amazing for this guy. Turns out it's not. Turns out it's not, and they basically just don't spawn here. What's Amy even waffling about? She's not going, I know. I know. She's called herself stress over something that's not even going to happen, so... Um, I can't believe we have three fortresses and all of them are just crap. I was thinking of options because trains aren't working normally to me. So if I was to come, I'd have to drive. No, maybe you've made it very clear you're not coming. You can't afford it, so it's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Well, we'll see you when we go fishing or something in a couple of months. Something like that. Uh, with the skellies. Oh, what a shot. Hi, Rover. Uh, on screen is what it looks like when you go outside of the area of the NEC in Birmingham. What, just crap? Mm. How annoying. It's, it's what you've said. I, I haven't done anything. I've just repeated what you've told me. Sir, come up here. Whoa. Damn it. Game. Be kind, please. It's 
travel online 900 pound. Oh, what? For a charger at your house? Yeah, they're, they are quite expensive. But you save a fuck ton of money. Like, it soon, very, very soon pays for itself. Uh, like, if you use public charging, the public charging network, it's kind of crazy. But the... Uh, if you get, like, a cheap overnight charging tariff of, like, seven pence a kilowatt or something like that, which you can get fairly easily in the UK, you can do... Somebody did the math. It's like 10,000 miles for 155 pounds. You can't argue with that. And at that point, the 900 pounds for your wall charger pays for itself within a year. Less than a year. Damn it! Fuck off! That didn't even hit me! That's bully button is said. What do you mean, bully button? I, I haven't bullied you. What have I done? I've just... I, all I've done, Amy, is state exactly what you've told me. That's all I've done. I've not made anything up. I've not... I've, I've said exactly what you said to me. I'm not coming because I can't afford it. It's exactly what you told me. Hey, there's one. Which is absolutely fine. Don't worry about it. We'll see you when we go fishing. No. Hi. Skull, please. Shit. Yeah, a fire rose potion actually would be quite nice, I must admit. Where's the other dude? Oh, he fell down here. Correct, Robert. But I don't, it's not an issue. This is the point. But with me, it's genuinely not a problem. Oh, there's two. Get in there. I was told by Amy, I'm not coming to Insomnia because I can't afford it. Fine. Absolutely fine. So, which brings up the conversation about parking interesting. It doesn't matter. She's not coming. Um. Hmm. Game, you don't be very kind with the skeletons, man. He's really going to... No, this is what she sold me! I'm just repeating what she sold me. She can't afford it. Uh, but she did spend fifty pounds on Sons of the Forest for both her and her boyfriend. But she can't afford twenty pounds in petrol, which is fine. So, you know, we'll see you whenever we see you. Then it's not, it's not an issue. Yeah. Calvary over it. He's smart. He might be baiting you. Oh, you think I'm smart? Thank you, ma'am. That's very kind. 50 pounds, yes. 25 pounds for Sons of the Forest, times two, which is 50. Um, but again, it's not an issue. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's not a problem. If it is on sale at the moment, I will be pissed off. It's the spring sale still going on. What? How's that finished already? Didn't it just start like three days ago? When did this end, chat? Well, that's bullshit. <laughs> How am I throwing his he fit? <laughs> I don't care. What do you mean? <laughs> it's like it's honestly fine. I don't know how many times I have to say it. It's not an issue. <laughs> oh god. Where's the skelly? Come here. I know. Can you tell how few I am right now? 
You'd never get. Maybe about the lying part, but other than that, it's not too. It's not a big deal, you know. It's your own life, you make decisions. It's not. It's not an issue. I know you're missing me. I will. I will. Very much so. I don't dispute that for a second. Blaze, don't piss me off. There should be more. I just don't understand why there's so little spawns going on here, man. Aha, you. Oh, to be fair, I'm not really checking the nether out. Right? If they're going to be spawning, like, down here and shit. I know, uh, Kev. But what, what other words can I use? Uh, my emotional response system responds neutrally. Is that better? Ah, oh, there's a lot of normal skeletons. There were the ones. Oh, there's the one. Maybe, Sir Alex. Maybe it's all a lie. Maybe everything's a fucking lie. Ever thought about that? No, but I'm saying he doesn't care about his friends. I don't know what to say. I can't win. We are skull hunting, Rob. Yeah, we need one more and we're good. Aha. Uh -huh. And this man is going to be the one to do it. I might be an AI. Maybe I've been an AI for all these years. Maybe someday I will be. Maybe someday I'll get a Neuralink and start sending tweets with my thoughts. That whole concept, by the way, is fucking nuts. I don't know how many people have seen that. Chat, how many of you have seen that dude with the Neuralink thing sending a tweet with his thoughts? And playing, like, Baldergate with his thoughts? Isn't that just fucked? Like, how is that even possible? Hey, there it is. Does anybody else not think that's absolutely fucked, that that's even possible? Human beings made a chip that they put into somebody's brain that allows them to control things by thinking. Just mental, isn't it? Absolutely mental. Oh, that's trippy. Ah, uh, we might as well kill these on the way back. Just have to set on fire here a second. I went 120 with a skill, skeleton kills, no skulls. I got three with 150. Yeah, it's kind of mad how the drop tables work. I think our most was 157 without one. That was pretty mad. Doing good, Ray Ray. How are you? Lovely to see you. I'm going to say hi to Ray Ray. Grab this for food, actually. We'll take it. Wait, do we even have soul sand? I think I only got four soul sand last time. That'll do. That'll do. I know. I've not seen Ray Ray in forever. You're sick today. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you feel better soon. Rob, thank you so much for all the love last week, by the way, mate. I think you finished number two on the leaderboard. Absolute legend. Thank you very much, pal. The Neuralink doesn't even control a keyboard. It kind of works like an eye tracker. And he activates controls and moves things on a screen. It's nuts, isn't it? I don't know fully how it works, but whatever it is, just the, the the concept of sending a tweet or playing a video game with nothing, like literally just sat here like this, just, just moving your eyes around, just fucking playing a game is absolutely insane. And it's like so early stages. Like it, to me, it almost says that it will get to a point where 
if you don't have a Neuralink chip in your brain or a chip of some sort in your brain like that, that presumably they produce, I think they're the only ones doing it. But if you don't have a chip in your brain, you're at a disadvantage to everybody else. Because eventually you'll probably be able to access the internet. All the information on it can be downloaded into your brain. It'd just be nuts. You can access anything you like just through thoughts. And the concept of that is absolutely fucked. Well, if the chip malfunctions, presumably your thoughts just go back to normal, right? You go, damn, I'm as thick as shit today. I must have had a chip phone. And you'll be like, cover me, I'm reloading. And you just go, like, chick, 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 chick. another one in. You love the cow? It's looking good, man. We've got a long way to go with it, though. Pretty big presumption. Might blow your brain up. True. I don't actually know how it's, like, powered. Like, is it powered through a battery? Presumably. What if the battery leaks battery acid onto your brain? I don't, who knows? Nobody knows. No, I think I agree, Amy. I think I would choose to be... If it meant I'm at a disadvantage, I think I'd just say fine. Because I don't want a fucking chip in my brain. I like being... This is me. Every six months, the chip's outdated. Yo, man, what chip are you rocking right now? I've got an AMD Ryzen 11. 1700 XM. Oh, no way, bro. I've got an Intel i3. It's funny. <laughs> I'm trying to think of what to say next, but it's still loading. Give me a second. He's got a little wind-up handle, yeah. Just sort of folds it out from his head. And says, I like being myself and not having AI control your brain. It doesn't control your brain. It enhances it. But you still have to do the thinking for it to get the information. Right? It doesn't just do it. You have to still be thinking it. Egg Ooh. Doesn't control it yet. Well, that's true. Maybe someday. Although, Amy, is there much control in your brain, really? Let's be honest. I'm joking, Amy. It's a joke. It's a joke. You know I love you. I'm kidding. Oh, stressed, man. Fuck sakes. Oh. Need to go play some more games? <laughs> Musk is out to build an army. Maybe. Maybe. Um, it's very true. Processing. £30 parking error. Oh, fuck sakes. I haven't done anything, man. I'm going to freeze my bank account. It's okay. I don't get upset about it. Somewhere. I am. I would have really liked to have seen you. I have no problems accepting that whatsoever. Right, we're going to do it right here. Um... All right. Snitches on you for speeding every time you speed. I go past the limit. That's actually quite amusing. Oh, Gary! Oh, what a shot! Now we've got his attention. We really need a smite sword for this sort of thing. That was a mess. All right, let me zoom over here real quick. Um, 
Let me zoom over here. Yeah, that was a bit of a mess. This is why we need smite, man. If we had smite and strength, we'd, you can you usually kill them with a sword in like three shots when they go into that second phase, but we don't have that. Okay, can we just stop? F in the chat with this chicken. Where was the horse that got annihilated? Well, that looks like it died from the explosion. No, it flew. Where did he fly? Oh, over here. No, there's not enough damage. The hell! Time to donate another beacon to the floor. Imagine. Aha! That looks like a one. And there's one more here. Two more here. Fantastic. Happy days. That'll be good for when we do finally make like a guardian farm and stuff, which will have to come. How many subs this time? Well, five was obviously far too fucking cheap. And I need this beacon. And I really can't be asked to get three more. So the cost of this would be... For this beacon in the sub floor only, is 27 subs, because that'll take us to 400 exactly. Yes, it's overpriced. Yes, it's deliberately overpriced. Because I don't want chat to do it. That's the point. It's not supposed to be affordable. Um, you gonna put it higher? I did twenty seven. I feel pretty safe. At. I feel pretty safe. At. Too cheap. No, 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 no. Definitely not. Definitely not. Oh my god, as if. What the fuck? What the fuck? Winston! Oh! Yeah. Right. Okay. I'll, I'll, um. I'll pass that on. I've just been informed by the production team that due to the prices of inflation between me saying 27 subs and the current rate of inflation, it's actually 28, which means you're one short, Winston. What a shame. Uh, I, there's nothing I can do about that, unfortunately. I'm really sorry. Um, yeah, I... Unfortunately, that's the way the world works. God, this is shit. I did, can I use this beacon for... <laughs> This is shit, man. Oh, God. Winston, thank you very much, mate, for the 28 gifted subs. That is very kind of you, pal. Can I use the beacon before? Or does it have to go straight in the floor? Oh, my God. Do I even have the obsidian? I don't. Straight into the dirt. This sucks, man. This is actually bollocks. I'm not happy about this. Winston, VAR has confirmed Winston is prepared to let me use it. What a nice guy. Thank you, pal. This is why we like Winston. Thank the Lord. Where did I put the other Wither Roses, by the way? Did I put them over here? Oh, I did. Uh, okay, let's quickly make this. I have no idea. Do we still have the diamond blocks? Oh, we do. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, chat, can we go to use all the hearts up for my man Winston? Dropping a fucking bomb. 28 subs. What a legend. Thank you very much, pal. That helps me out more than you'd ever know. So thank you very, very much. Parts of the chat, Winston, boys. This show will not continue without them. Uh, all right, let's grab this. So we do need to go get some more brown tergatea. What a legend. And there it is. Back over 400 subs again. That is extremely kind. Thank you, mate.
Sleeping. Oh dear. Did we all have a good weekend though, chat? Has everybody been uh, having fun? Anyone do anything fancy? Anything exciting? Anything special? Anything special? You were sick yesterday. Sorry to hear that, Andrew. Your, bir uh, your birthday was yesterday. Well, happy birthday for yesterday, man. I hope you had a good day. How much does Twitch pay per 100 bits? It's a dollar. So bits are one to one. If you cheer a thousand bits, I get ten dollars. If you cheer a hundred bits, I get one dollar. If you cheer one bit, I get one cent. It's one to one. Because you pay the VAT when you buy the bits uh, so that the streamer gets 100% of that, that tip, right? Meh Friday, but the rest of the weekend was relaxing. Well, that's always good, Kaz. That's always good. Um, oh, I never sent you those um, bunny pictures over. I meant to do that. Sorry, I completely forgot. Please shout at me and remind me, Kaz, because I will continue to forget. Um... Right, let me think here. Oh, we were chilling at the side of this mountain. But it, it didn't go all the way through. This one might, because it's a little bit higher. So we'll try this. We'll try this. No, no, it's never annoying, Kaz. Just shout at me. Just be like, fucking sort your shit out. That's no problem. It's no issue. When am I next on games? Uh, well, it'll all be during insomnia. It'll all be during insomnia. I might be about Tuesday for a little bit, but... I've got a lot to do for it, Sonia. And then it's on there, it will be just lots of games, so I'll be around a lot. Um, Mr. Chibzor! Happy sub day. Eight months, mate. What a legend. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, pal. Hope you're doing well. Almost a Twitch baby, by the way. Thank you, my man. I'll yell at you nicely later on. That's totally fine. You know I feel bad. You don't need to feel bad. I have probably one of the worst brains in terms of memory of any 25 year old in the world like my brain is horrific so i just forget everything so you the best bet is just to nag me until i do it and i will get it done no no i'm your friend kaz there's nothing to be anxious about just shout at me it's right jack you fucking bell end you promised me this get it done get it done I'm like, yeah, right, do it now, do it now. Hey, Spindura's getting a sub. Boom. Enjoy, mate. Enjoy. Takes three weeks to pin button down for a meeting, then the day before he forgets. That's like, else. We had it eventually, Alex. Honestly, it's a nightmare. Although I have been better at documenting what I've got going on in my in my reminders now. I've started using my reminders a lot more because I just cannot keep up with everything. So I now put things in my reminders of when I've got stuff when. Morning, noisy. How are you? No, there's just genuinely not enough hours in the day to do everything I need to do. That's the problem. That's the problem. Just buy a calendar. No, because the boxes of a calendar aren't big enough to fill out everything I have to do in a day. Unfortunately. Um, so it's just best to use the phone and just do it that way. Have a big list of everything and remove it one by one. Which has worked out pretty well so far. Okay. Keep going. It doesn't like there's not going to be any stone in this, which is good. We just want pure terracotta. 
Arnold's home. I don't know if he's had a haircut. He's met... Arnold's having his first haircut today, chap, for anybody that gives a fuck. I don't know if he's had it yet. I don't know if he's had it. How big is he now? He's massive now. I can't even remember when I last showed him on stream. But he'll be, he's pretty big. He's a big boy. He's a big boy. But I don't know if he's... He might have gone for a walk. I don't know if he's had his haircut today. It might be later on today he's had it. Why, when they get a haircut, do people say, oh, but when I get one, no one finds that impressive? Well, that's very true, Robert. That's very, very relatable. People say nice haircut, but no one actually gives a fuck, you know what I mean? And no one actually cares. So, yeah. But no, as soon as my dog gets a fucking haircut, everyone's like, oh, he's so cute. Actually, though, if anyone referred to me as that, I'd probably just bomb. So, no, never mind. Never mind. I'm actually happy everybody doesn't acknowledge it. I like dogs. I don't like humans. Dogs are pretty good. I must admit. Humans do generally suck. That's very true. Um, but that is very true. Although dogs can fetch beers. They can't open cans of beers, but they can fetch them. That's pretty... Pretty handy. I've seen TikToks of some dudes trading their dogs to open the fridge. They put like a rope on the fridge door so you can open the fridge door, grab a beer, and deliver it to them. That's pretty amazing, if you ask me. That's pretty incredible, if you ask me. Right, let's grab uh, this. We won't forget the beacon, don't worry about that. Uh, that's Oh, that's a good point, actually, for space. That, yeah, that's true. That's very true. Big up Winston, by the way, for letting me fucking do this shit with, uh, with the beacon prior to putting it into the floor. Uh, 
Okay. Hey, Zandrin, how are you? Hey, Helix, good to see you guys. That's going to have to go. We're fine. Cool. Gotta sleep again, man. Why did he just slept? Sleeping. Oh, man. I'm so excited for Insomnia, man. Fuck. It's going to be great. I can't wait. I'm just terrified it's going to go so quick because it will. Because that's what Insomnia does. But it's going to be so good, man. We're going to have streams in there. Good times with good people. Good food. Oh. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be amazing. I just wish it was a week. Granted, it would cost a fucking fortune if it was a week. It already does, but... A week would just be insane. But, ah, oh, it'd just be so good, man. So you could do all your restaurants you wanted to do. You could chill out uh, and have get settled and have loads of games for like a week. It'd, be just, it'd just be great. <sighs> it'd just be great. But are you going to get, oh dear, I probably will. I probably will. That'll be a good laugh to play in the evening. That'll be a good laugh to play. Oh, yeah. All right. Right, Winston, here we go, buddy. I don't know if he's still here, but his beacon is going in the floor. His beacon is going in the floor. Uh, well, that's where the first one is. Let's try and keep these a little bit of a distance. Maybe like right here. There we go. There's the second one. Fuck's sake, man. I need another beacon. That's ready to go for what we do after the next beacon. Whatever that may be. Right, let's, uh... This. Yeah, I probably will get Odeer, though. It doesn't like that would be a good fun. Stop trying to escape, man. Please. No, thank you, Winston. Appreciate the uh, inc incredible amount of support. A legend there. Move, please. Chat, I only had a cigar like a week ago, and I want another one. It's not good. It's not good. I found a new one that was super nice, and I've thoroughly enjoyed it to the point I want another one. You think England can beat Belgium tomorrow? Not with fucking Southgate in charge. Yeah, I, 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 I usually only have a few a year, to be fair. It's usually only a few a year. I'm season two. We did. We did. All the love in chat for button, please. No, nobody loves me here, Winston. You're on your own with that one, buddy. Everyone just hates me. Everyone hates me. No one's nice to me. It's just the reality of it all, mate. Don't worry about it. I've accepted the reality of it all, so it's not a problem. It is just a shame. Uh, right, we need to go get ink sacks. That's the next thing we need, because we need to go get more light grey wool. 
Uh, I have 12. Fuck it, we'll get those as well. Why not write a book about it? <laughs> You've written all about it in your new book. Wah. Right, I need to grab uh, some paper. To be fair, we're getting through the sugar guide now as well. Let's put it this way. If Bottom was a part of a bell tower, he'd be the end. True. Hooray. Oh. Maybe we'll come back to that. Oh, bro. Holy fucking shit. Coming on in. All right, Rod. Thank you for the 5,000 biddies, mate. Holy fucking shit. Coming in again, being a hero. What an absolute legend. Thank you, pal. Taking the number one spot back straight away this week after holding it last week at the very end. Yoinking it from Rob at the very end. Thank you very much, mate. That is 10 blocks in the floor and we update the streak. We update the streak. There it is. 99 streams in a row. Crazy. No, I still had the uh, the Elite Rod. I started flying. If you put it in 0.25 speed, look at the hill at the back when I pitch up. You see, I start to fly, and then I just fall like a stone. Black Blaze Terracotta. We can do that, mate. No worries. No worries. Uh, let's bang this in here real quick. Boom. All right, let's rumble. Hi, Tadness. Um... I heard they're looking to sign Southgate as a coach after Ten Hag Man United. Mate, if they do that after what he did on fucking Saturday, holy shit. I am Ineos out all the way. They are morons if they think he's the man. No way. I'm Ten Hag in until the very end. I think, I think Ten Hag is great. Give him the resources and it will thrive. Um, so you hate journalists and now you wrote a book about reporting on the lives of the royal family, so you're just a journalist. No, I haven't written a, written a book. Where? Although, pff, mate, everything's just fucked, right? You know this whole Kate stuff has come out about she's got cancer or whatever, right? And they released that video. In the video, I didn't notice this, but I see it all on Twitter. You see her ring disappears. Like, and it's, it's, like she lifts her hand up. And it's like a f massive ring that you'd easily be able to see. She lifts her hand up and it's gone. Then she puts it down and it's back up and it's back there again. I don't know how many people saw that shit on uh, on Twitter. It's fucked. Absolutely fucked. Um, what if I got a, a thing of it up here straight away? Like, I'm not into the whole conspiracy thing. I don't care, right? But the it's very strange, that Kate stuff. Very strange. Yeah, I can't even see it on there, but have a look on it. It's just mental, man. It's absolutely mental. Um, but yeah, may she rest and get well soon. But still, it's fucked. Oh, there's black dye as well. Oh, you know what? Sod it. Let's just go. Let's just go. Let's go. Harry hates journalists, but reports on the life of his family. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, for sure. I don't really get involved in the whole royal family stuff. Honestly. I don't really care, you know. You crack on. Life's hard enough as it is without worrying about that sort of shit. Crack up. I'll be in the pub if you need me. Um, uh, I mean, you know, just 
It's all crazy. I, you know what I don't understand? This is what I don't understand the most about all of this, right? Whether all this shit's fake or not, who cares? You know, whatever. But how do people have the brain energy to sit there and analyze every little detail about something? I just don't get it. I, I'm exhausted at the end of the day. I work fucking hard every day, all day, right? Very rarely do I sit down and just chill. I've done it a little bit more recently because I've needed to, but... Other than that, I very rarely take breaks, right? It's just, every day it's just working. And by the end of the day, and I've done most of the things I need to do, I'm knackered. But some people have enough time in the day to sit down and analyze and pick fault with every little detail of stuff. It's just crazy. I don't know how people have time to do that. It is, uh, it is baffling. It is baffling. Uh, if you look at the bottom right of the cam, you can clearly see uh, there's a shadow. I'm pretty sure buttons like this has been generated by AI. Yes. It's all generated by AI, and I am, in fact, dead. Yes, that's very true. Robert's figured it out like the mastermind he is. That's impressive, Robert, that you put those pieces together like that. Very impressive stuff. <laughs> oh, I've actually just woken up this morning, turned my computer on, and gone to the pub. All day. All day, every day. 12 hours a day. Honestly, I've not been to my local... I've been to my local pub maybe three times this year. That's it. It's pretty crazy, man. I just just haven't been there. And I know if I wanted to go there. I've just been like... Just can't be asked. I just can't be asked. I'd rather be working. Fans might be hard to ever see his hands. True. More to the point, have you ever seen my ears? How about that? No, I'm not giving up drinking. Because I do like having a beer. But what I am phasing out of is getting drunk. I just... I just feel like shit when I do it. Like, I, so for example, the football on... Was it Friday or Saturday? Saturday, I think it was. I went to the football. I had four beers over the course of about six hours, which is not really a lot, right? I came home. I went to my nan's to see her. And I had a, another can of beer there and a small whiskey. That well, wasn't a small whiskey, but... And a glass of whiskey, right? Like, like that. Like a glass. And I woke up the next day and I felt like absolute shit. And I, I don't understand. I, I wasn't drunk. I don't, didn't feel pissed in any way. And I just woke up feeling like death. And I've paced myself. I've drunk slowly so I don't feel like crap. And I still feel like crap. So now it's just like, what's the fucking point? Matt does have ears. Matt has little pointy ears. He does. Your liver is telling you to give booze up. Perhaps. Perhaps. I'll never give it up entirely. Because I do like going and having a few beers with friends. And having a laugh. It's good fun. But. Uh, intake will be lowered even more. Yeah, alcohol is a toxin. But when it's gradually drank like slowly. It's not too bad. But. That just fuck me up man. Maybe it was a culmination of Friday hadn't maybe fully left my system because I got quite pissed on Friday on uh, on date night. Being buzzed is fun with mates. Getting shit faced is just not as appealing anymore. No. I used to love getting smashed, but I just 
Nah, not for me anymore. Not for me anymore. But I'm also at that age now where you've got to start looking towards the uh, towards the the future, right? I've got to start looking towards the future. I'm 25. I'm not getting any younger. At some point, we've got to start considering moving out, which I already have been doing. We've got to start considering settling. We've got to start considering, you know, being a little bit more responsible with savings rather than spending it on beer. At some point, you've got to start considering that. And whilst a lot of my friends prefer to just live in the moment and spend all of their money down the pub or whatever, that's fine. For me, that's not an option, right? Because I don't want to be living paycheck to paycheck forever. I don't want to be living in some nasty little house that's falling to bits, you know? And more importantly, when I do get to the point of having children, which I'd like to have, I would also like them to have a a nice, comfortable upbringing, right? So, those sorts of things are coming into, into mind now. So, it's sort of, you know, settling at 25. Yeah. I've got things to do, man. i got things to do. As much as I love going to the pub, I've just got things to do. You're in your first season of Friends. Unpopular opinion, but Friends is one of the most overrated shows ever. I said it, and I'm not ashamed of it. It's it's the most mediocre shit ever. I've seen a few episodes of it, and it's just not very funny. I don't understand it. It's not very funny. The humor's crap. Why it's the most popular show is beyond me. And that's my opinion on friends. Whoa! Give me that shit, you bastard. Your mum loves that show. Honestly, I know a few people that are obsessed with it. Obsessed. And I just don't I just don't see the appeal. Like it's okay. At best. It's not very funny. Um but, but you don't understand. Ross has a monkey. It's hilarious. It's just... My opinion, Robert. It's childish stuff, mate. It's childish stuff. You love Friends? I'm sorry, Noisy. But friends is just wank. I've said it. I've said it. Got to go, unfortunately. I hope to see you next uh, when we hit the 100 stream streak. Hey, Winston, thank you so much, mate. Maybe. Maybe. Tomorrow is the day. If we're going to hit it, it's tomorrow. We'll see. Big Bang Theory is another one. Everyone seems to think that's hilarious. I, I think it's bang average. Wait. It's okay. I've seen bits and bobs of suits, and I did actually quite like the little bits and bobs I saw. I did quite like that, but I've never like sat and watched like the whole thing. I've just seen like clips and things. Uh, what are we killing squid for? Uh, exacts. Yeah, the clips I've seen of suits do look pretty good. But I recognise his wank because he's a wanker. Well. I hate to break it to you, Mama but as are most men. Yep. I would say most dudes here are wankers. And or have partaken in the activity of wanking, therefore making them a wanker. 
Um, some zones are only good because of how cringe they are. I just say, stop for me. It's like that. All right. I used to like Big Bang Theory until I stopped to think about it. Now I kind of hate it. That's fair enough. I've never seen Peaky Blinders, but I've heard good things of it. You've been making your boyfriend watch Grey's and Ask Beat. And that, how do you have time to watch that? I, I, had, I had a chat with the missus yesterday about that show and how many seasons it is. Because she's watching it at the moment. There's twenty, about to be 20 seasons. Each containing like 20 or 30 episodes. Each are 45 minutes to an hour long. That is so much time. Like, let's do the math on this, right? So there's 20 seasons. We'll take an average of 25 episodes, right? With 25 episodes in, each episode is about 45 to an hour long, right? So we'll say 50 minutes long. That's 25,000 minutes of your life. Divided, not that, divided by 60, 416 hours of your life. <laughs> what the fuck? That's just nuts. Uh, divide that by 24, 17 days of your life watching a show. Half a month. Half a month of your life. God, watching a show. That's just mental. <laughs> Who has that amount of time? I don't understand it. <laughs> oh, God. Which so? Grey's Anatomy. And there's probably ones even bigger than that. God knows how long it would take you to get through all of Friends. It's called relaxing and enjoying life. True, but wouldn't you want to actually go, go out and do something for 17 days? If you watch, you'd understand it's addicting. I can watch shows, but in small bursts. I can't I can't sit there and... I used to be able to do it with Money Heist, actually. But other than that, I can't sit there and binge watch these sorts of things. Give me a 20-minute episode of Rick and Morty. That'll do me. That'll do me. I might watch two if I fancy it. And that's it. I'm done. I've got things to do, you know? Oh, his friend's only 86 hours. I thought Friends was massive. Like, loads of seasons. Yeah, Suits I probably would give a go. Because, I, like I say, the clips I have seen of it are actually quite good. No. Nearly had a creeper explode in the farm. That would have been bad. The Simpsons is good. Again, in just like a, a single burst or two. Or an episode or two, and that'll do. Curly, fucking out! Spoilers! Holy shit! Enormous spoilers from Curly right there. Nobody read that message. No, don't ask who. Somebody dies. It grazes that. Now I can't watch it because I know it's going to be crap. I know somebody's going to die at some point. Ruined. Ruined. It's been out long enough, it has. I'm now going to blow everybody's mind with an activity that I've decided I'm going to do. 
Because as I say, 20 minute, 30 minute bursts, that's enough for me. That's all. And then I've got shit to do, right? So I've decided I'm going to start reading books. Yeah. I'm going to start reading books. I've decided I'm going to start with the Harry Potter series. I've watched the films a million times and I really enjoy them. So I'm going to start reading the Harry Potter books. Yep. Yeah. I'm starting with those. And uh, I'm going to sit and read those for 20, 30 minutes of an evening. And read them. Because I'm curious. Because I can only focus on a book that captures me. Right? And Harry Potter I find interesting. So it's something that would capture me. So I'm going to give it a whirl. And the books, yeah, like M. Curl says, are apparently so much more detailed. Barton's going to become an annoying book person. <laughs> hey, what? what's an annoying book person? First he watches the films, then he reads the books. What about another book, Barton? No, because apparently the books are like way more detailed than the films of Harry Potter. So I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to read the books. Might take me a while because I'll only read like 30 odd minutes at a time. That'll do me. But I'm going to do it. I'm not reading it to chat, no. How many times have I watched all the films? <laughs> God knows. God knows. Um, I remember like 15 or 20 times I've watched them all. What's this about you getting a book from... Oh, I went into a bookstore yesterday because... The other half's into, into her reading and stuff. So she wanted to go into a bookstore. So we went in there. And I was just having a look around. And I went into the children's section. Because Robotron. Some of you guys will know Robotron. The guy who does the dark room. Um, wrote a book and released it. It's a children's book. So I was like, I wonder if they have it. So I went to have a look. And then in there, I found the book of Minecraft. And all of the... Uh, all of the... Um, the stuff to do with that. And... Uh, it was an ideas book for things to build. So I was like, okay, this is kind of cool. And uh, I had a little flick through, and there were actually some cool builds in there, but I didn't buy it because I wasn't paying six pounds for a book of Minecraft ideas, you know. What does she read? Oh, God, that would be a conversation you'd have to have with her. I have absolutely no idea. She was telling me all this stuff, and... Uh, I didn't really understand what she was saying, but I was... I could appreciate her passion for it. So, I, I did my best to understand, but I'm sure I'll learn more as time goes on. Um, Stephen somebody? She said she enjoys his writing. Stephen someone? S Stephen King, is it Stephen King? Something like that. Might be Stephen King. Um, she said she enjoys his writing. Some Stephanie girl. Stephanie something. Um, so she doesn't mind her. These were questions you'd have to ask her when chat figure out her identity. Maya? It might be. Might be. Homework with buttons to find out the books. <coughs> She'll probably watch the video um, of the VOD and tell me, and I'll tell chat. Does the Stephen King do horrors? Yeah, she likes her horror books. She likes all sorts of stuff. She, she's she's got like her own little mini library in her at her place, and she's just got fucking thousands of books there, all in pristine condition. It is really cool. When I'm moving, I've decided I've claimed that room as the studio now. So when I do move into that and have my little office in there. The background will be all of her books. We can, I can read, tell chat what she's got then. Because we'll probably sack the green screen off and have that as a background. Because it will be a cool as hell background. Um, doing good, big girl. How are you? Moving in. No, I'm not moving in yet. I claimed it the first time I ever went to her place. I claimed that room as the studio. And she just accepted. So, yep, that's fine. Um... Right, let me think here. I need to do the left side and the arse of a cow. Let's do the arse first. I need a... Where is the cow? There was one down here somewhere.
Ah, you seem to have, ah, your udders are visible from the back. I see. They hang below the legs. What else we got here? Excuse me. I don't know if we'd be able to get away with it in just one color. We could just bullshit our way through the others. That'd be fine. A thousand books officially qualifies as a library. I don't think she has a thousand. There's a lot, though. There's probably a couple hundred. She's got a lot. Right. Skirt. Sir, if you could just stand still, I'd like to take a picture of your ass. Can you just stand still for me, please? Stay there. There you go. Right, let me zoom in on here. Sir? I don't know. Sir, ma'am, whatever. Listen, we accept everybody in their genders chat, alright? Let's not, let's not just... A cow could be anything he wants to be, right? If people can be anything they want to be, that cow can identify as a lion if he wants to. It's fine. So, less of the judgment, please, people. Less of the judgment, please. We're, we're inclusive in this community. I've got a droid of a cow in my classroom called Steve, and he has udders, so we just roll with it. See? Chat, do better. Do better. You should be more inclusive. Cow lives matter. How about that? Else there'll be no delicious steak. Oh, God. I love steak, man. Oh, God. I can annihilate a fucking steak right now. I just want to... Just give me a massive joint of steak. You're literally making a slaughterhouse and saying cow lies matter. They do. Cow lies matter for steak. Where is the steak going to come from if it isn't a cow? Exactly. Steak's expensive. It is. But this is why you have to be smart about it. If you go to one of these like Brazilian radisserie restaurants, they do like uh, all you can eat meat and they just come out of these massive skewers of ribeye and rump and chicken and sausages and lamb and all sorts of shit and it's like 36 pounds for all you can eat and you just have mounds and mounds of meat and it's just amazing flat iron is good problem is row rip flat iron prices are going up and when you when you factor in that the steak is only 200 grams and you're paying what 13 pounds you're then paying 26 pounds for a 400 gram steak granted it's good but that 26 pounds for a 400 grams of steak is actually not that good of a deal um, steak Saturday Me, uh, Imp and Matt are going for a meal We are Am I paying for your steak on Saturday? How about you paying for my steak on Saturday? Imp? How about that? We just gave you like $150 for your birthday How do you want me to pay for your steak? How about you pay for my steak? I think that's fair um, I do have gift cards by the way Imp uh, Matt has them as well. So whatever this meal is going to cost, it's going to be very cheap. Uh, I think me and Matt between us have £150 worth of gift cards for Millers. So that's kind of a win. I got two for my birthday and Matt got them gifted from stream. Yeah. I want you to pay for it, not chat. I included some money in that pot as well. Wow! Talk about ungrateful. Jesus. It's the last time we ever do that for him. Dear Lord. Dear Lord. Uh, there we go. Hey! Pay for your stake? Pretty sure there's laws against that. What do you mean? What do you mean? Miller and Farters. What do you mean, farters? 
Ben and Carter's is like it's good. It's middle of the it's middle of the road, sort of a mid mid end steakhouse. You're probably gonna get a pretty good steak. I think I've only had a couple of meh ones from there. It's gonna be pretty good. Bish bash jobs up. Um, what do I need here? Button think. Think, 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 pink. We need pink wool. Uh, let me go get some more wool there real quick. It's so expensive. For what you get at Miller's, it's actually not that expensive. Because I don't think I've ever left a Miller's feeling not hungry, you know. Like, you get a big old wad of ribeye. A nice little amount of chips. Get your sauce in there as well. Have the sticky chicken for a starter. And you are, you've had some good quality food at mid-level prices for what you're getting. Went to Miller's once and really wasn't blown away. Yeah, I've had a couple of meh ones over the years. I've had a couple of meh ones over the years, but generally, you can't really go wrong with it. But sometimes, Amy, it's not about that. Sometimes it's about going out, just enjoying a meal with some friends and having a nice evening out. Right. Okay. Hi, Alice. Hello. Are you happy now? Hello. Kristen, 42 months. And that's actually a very good point, Robert. There's no way Amy's cooking a steak to the level of Miller's. No way. Um, Kristen, thank you for the 42. Welcome back. That is a very good point. Uh, there we go. We'll grab... I need, what else do I need for pink? Red and red and white, right? Yeah, I can. Um, sure. Mm, mm, mm. I absolutely can, Amy. I cook for this all the time. I am the chef of the house. I have to do the cooking. I have to do the cooking. That is incorrect, and a nibble should not be received for you. Uh, two stacks is probably not enough. We'll do four stacks. Worst comes to worst, we have a load of pink dice, but whatever. Um, as soon as this cow is done, by the way, chat, we need to figure out a storage solution, because this sucks. I just want everybody to know that. Um, we'll do two at a time, though, because we're going to... Use cherry flowers. Oh, for the pig. Yeah, you could do. Amy is a chef. Alice, I've seen what comes out of her boyfriend's ass. All right. I wouldn't cast that as a chef. I would cast that as food poisoning. But there you go. I digress. One, two, three. Oh, this is right. It's a weird thing to say. No. It's men. It's men. That was his cooking. He blamed on you. He blamed on you. And said, this is what Amy's cooking has caused. Can I go to switch to gear? Sure. I'm just repeating what he said. There's nothing to snitch about. You can go for it. So, I'm sorry, Amy. No, you really don't. Amy. You really don't. This is going to be stupid. How the hell am I going to get up here? Give me some dirt. So, well, I've sent a picture of a shit to your best friend. There you go. Thank you. It happens. Right. 
sometimes evidence is needed for certain things. And this was an evidence of Amy's cooking that can't have been very good because he, he appears to be rather unwell. I'm not going to have enough to even get up here, I don't think. Okay, that was his cooking. One of you's not telling the truth here, Amy, and I don't know who. That's all I'm saying. Somebody is not telling the truth. That's all I have to say. You always tell the truth. Uh, how's your day been today? I'm going to be... My day has been going really bad because I'm really sick. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, man. That's a bit shit. I hope you feel better soon. Whatever it is. Okay, Amy, this is a conversation for you and him to have. I'm not getting involved in this relationship dispute. There we are. I have no desire to take a picture of it, let alone send it to someone. Look, sometimes you produce magic and you have to share it with the world. There's a very good episode of South Park where Jerry does that. Produces the most unreal poo and just has to tell everybody about it. And that's just a man conversation. It happens. It happens. And fellow dudes will appear and be like, that, I was fucking sick. No, I'm, not, I'm, not looking, I'm not looking at another dude's weed. I don't want to see that shit. No. Uh, right, I need to actually look under this cow, though. Can you just stay here for a second? So his... Her, his, whatever. Udders come forward one from the leg. So... Doesn't happen. It absolutely does happen. If you don't think it does, you're very naive to the world. I assure you that. Uh, one. So this is one. Oh, it doesn't matter. I'll just go one in front of the leg. It's fine. We should probably put in some like pink terracotta or something in here to like switch up the shades. Whoops. Definitely need more here. It's not a problem. The wall supplies are not great. Cows are they them or who wear? Yeah. Who wear is a personal favourite. Okay. Yeah, we can probably do a splitting this up a little bit. I mean, I have me a man for longer than you've been alive. I've never sent a receipt picture of that in any form from mates. If an exception doesn't disprove the rule. <laughs> it happens. It happens. Out of, it happens with multiple people. It's the reality of the world. At some point in life, you must have seen some enormous dookie and gone, fair play. That's impressive. You must have done. Whether it be something somebody's left or something like that, you must have just gone, damn, fair play. I don't think there's anything wrong with respecting an art. There you go. I'm gonna send in one of my next time I have a next time I have a uh, uh, a masterpiece. Uh, I will send it to him. I may have thought it, but never taken a picture or wanted to share it. So you have thought it. There you go. So right there, it just, just proves everything. There may not have been photographic evidence, but you've thought it. There you go.
done. Yeah, it does have to be a monster. Not just a random time we've gone to the door. It has to be something like seriously impressive. Seriously impressive. We're like, wow. Worthy of like a handshake. Like that sort of level. Raven! Five years! Five years, button. Holy fucking shit! Technically, though, due to your double sub, it's actually a hundred months. Uh, 120 months. Ten years. <laughs> Thank you, Raven. Hope you're doing well, mate. Good to see you, pal. Uh, bone meal, bone meal, bone meal. Hope we do have some left. Can I just say, chat, this channel is very unique. You don't get these sorts of conversations anywhere else on the internet except here, okay? I hope you all appreciate the, the wonders we have in this community. Even yourself. Not just looking and giving yourself a pat on the back. Even something you've conjured yourself, you must have at some point produced something insane and gone, damn, fair play. In your own head. So almost been proud of it. You've appreciated your creation. Because it's just a man thing to do. It just happens. Ladies, this is the way a lot of men work. Okay? We're simple folk. Women may do it and just not tell us, but that's fine. Women do it too, you see? So I'm being outcast for an opinion that actually is just what everybody does anyway. Uh, button read match Twitter. Match Twitter. Oh shit. Uh I'll shoot my message. Well, hopefully, he's got time to figure out whatever it is. Uh, I mean, it's something is three days away, so hopefully that's enough time to sort whatever needs to be sorted. If he can't go, that would be pretty devastating. Um... Yeah. We'll see. And then this will come up. Like so. It's a big cow. It is a big cow. It is a big cow. So these are going to be udders and we'll attach udders underneath afterwards. Yeah, I've shot him a message. See what's going on. If he wants to share, he knows he can. Obviously, but... We should see. I will accept the camp that says they haven't sent a pick. I will accept the camp who says they have sent a pick. The real outcasts are those saying they don't look. Very true. That's bullshit. If anybody tells you that, they're lying to you. They are telling you a whopper. Because there is no way... Actually, we'll finish the back of the cow first. There is no way in hell you don't look. Of course you do. Of course you do. You have to. Like, what if, what if there's something wrong with you? You know? If it's enormous and it actually hurts, you can feel yourself almost tearing. You're like, shit. I better check if there's any blood there. You know, you, you do look. That's the reality of it. And as Robert says, anybody that denies that is a liar. Simple as that. 
simple as that. It's literally that simple. Why is why is the stream making me crave a steak? Oh, are you still on the steak? Yeah, look, mate, steak is just fucking good. I I could demolish many steaks. I just I just love steak, man. It's so fucking good. One of the best meats, if not the best, when cooked correctly. What is the best meat though? Oh, you're joking. That fell off the edge. Fuck's sake. What is the best meat? When cooked to perfection. It's got to be... Yeah, Robert, I think you've nailed it on the head straight away. Beef for taste. Chicken for versatility. Although you can be pretty versatile with beef as well. You can be pretty versatile with that. I mean, chicken, obviously, you can fry it. You can grill it. You can make it into little chicken balls. There's, there's all sorts you can do with it. I guess maybe it is more versatile than beef. You can still do a lot with beef. Elk. Do you know what? One I've always really wanted to try is venison. Venison is apparently amazing, and I've never, ever had it. Worst of all the meats is lamb. Oh, no. Lamb lamb can be pretty good. I've got to, I've got to disagree there. I've got to disagree. Air fry everything, and I've got to disagree there as well. I really want, when I have my own place, I'm going to buy one. I want a smoker. Because there's a dude I follow on TikTok, and I know others that do it as well, but there's this guy on TikTok that does it, and he puts like a big old brisket in a smoker. Oh my god. Leaves it there for like 16 hours. Comes out, just like carves it all up, and it just looks... I'm actually drooling thinking about it now. It just looks absolutely phenomenal. Phenomenal. Pork for me is a bottom. I'd rather have lamb than pork. I'm not a big pork fan. I like a sausage. And I like a bit of bacon. But like, if somebody was to give me like a pork loin or like a, you know, just like a piece of pork. I'm just, you know, it's not really for me. Not really for me. Fish. I do like my fish. I do like my fish. I would probably have to go based on what I would love to eat if it was cooked perfectly. It has to be beef, chicken, fish, lamb pork. Because some of the f some of the flavors you can get from fish is just insane, especially when you start putting it in things like sushi and stuff. Oh my god, just unbelievable. I've not had sushi in a long time now. Now I want sushi. God damn it. Oh, God. Sushi is just heaven, Amy. It's absolutely heaven. As long as it's good sushi. Bad sushi is crap. If you go to, like, Tesco and get some of the three-pound clearance stuff. It's okay, but it's pretty crap. But you get, like, proper sushi. Like, oh, my God. Sensational. Sushi is the most overrated food on the planet, on planet Earth. Normal fish, very good. I, I have to say you've had bad sushi in that case, mate, because if it's sushi, it just falls apart, dissolves in your mouth. You just get a wave of all these different flavors. It's, and, and sushi is also a very broad term. Like, there are so many different types of sushi, like thousands of different types of sushi. They're just saying sushi is kind of a bit generalized, but if you're talking like the sushi that's just rice with some fish eggs in it, but if you're talking, they put like some fucking, oh, I don't even know. I try to think of what the one was they did in Berlin. It was just unreal, man. Can't go wrong with salmon though, to be fair. Salmon is, salmon's pretty top tier. I have to agree. Uh, so this will be two, three, this looks a bit darker, so I'm going to do this as stone. Something different. Um, 
do this in stone. Uh, and my brown. Perfect! That actually works out awesome. I've built the wrong layer chat. I wasn't paying attention. For God's sake. I had sushi with sea urchin in Japan. That was great. Interesting. Yeah, I bet Japanese... Uh, Japanese. I bet Japan's a great place to have sushi. It would just be unreal. Wagyu beef is just, or Wagyu, however you want to say it, is just insane. I've, I've only ever had one proper piece of Wagyu beef in a meal. Like, a lot of people advertise it as Wagyu, but it's not, right? But it's not true Wagyu. I've had one proper, true piece of Wagyu meat, and it was a Wagyu rump that I bought when I was in Australia. A rump is just ass, right? Rump is the arse of a cow. It's it's generally like the worst bit of meat, right? And it was one of the best steaks I've ever eaten. It was absolutely insane. Absolutely insane. I would love to know what like a ribeye is like, like a proper way of ribeye, but like an A1. You just look it up. Hundreds of pounds. So that's two. Which, unless you're making thousands of pounds a month, is just not, it's not feasible. You like ones that include fruit or vegetables? Yeah, uh, like this one in Germany, I, it had like, it was like rice with a seaweed wrapped around it. But then it had like some sort of a sauce in there. With avocado, cucumber. I think it was salmon. I think it was salmon in there. And it was just phenomenal. Like, it, it just absolutely exploded with flavor in your mouth. It was crazy. Probably teriyaki. No, it was a custom made thing. It was like his, this guy's own thing. We basically, we walked into this sushi place. We hired the whole restaurant. And we said, right, we want the whole restaurant. We'll do all you can eat sushi. We'll all give you 50 euros and we do all you can eat. And he went, yep, deal. So he was just pumping out this sushi just for ages, right? And uh, the final one we had, he said, I'm, I'm going to do some of my own stuff like that he's come up with. And I don't know what it was, but it was unbelievable. It was so, so good. It was so, so good. That was at TwitchCon Berlin, yep. Because he would... I don't know if... Did you go, Ruben? I, there was a lot of us that went. We hired, we said we want the whole restaurant from this period of time. And he said he'd kick everybody out that was in there at the time. But he he didn't. Uh, which was quite bad of him, really. But I assume when, when you say... Not many people call and say, I want the whole restaurant for a couple hours. But... Yeah, it was pretty nuts. He was there with the guys. Yeah, that was TwitchCon EU. 2019, of That shit was good, man. Twitch on Berlin, you mean the place you ruined a multi-million dollar Bob Ross banner? It wasn't a multi-million dollar banner. It probably cost him a couple grand. I did feel terrible about that. But they understood that it was a complete accident, but they were definitely furious about it. Wait, is this even going to add up? One, two, three, four, five. We've got like five left. We've just done this row. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, no, it will. It will. It will. Yeah, there was the little boats that went round on like the little stream thing. So that's... Uh 
Like that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Why is this like this? Robert, where was the place we were when you had the... You ordered like 1.6 kilos of Chateaubriand. It's like ridiculous. Was that a Twitch London? It might have been a Twitch London. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This doesn't make any sense. 10, 11, 12, when it's one over. Why is it one over? We are over the leg here. Wait. Is this whole cow wrong? Wait, 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 wait. It can't, no, it can't be. No, that's right. Why does this not line up? Burn it down. And why does this not line up? I don't understand. This should be... Oh, this back leg is one too wide. Oh, button, you fucking knob. For God's sake. This one's okay, isn't it? Yeah, it's this back leg. Look at that. What the hell? Oh, my God. I'm so fucking dumb. How have I managed to do that? That is a rookie error if I've ever seen one. Have I ever counted correctly? I actually don't think I have. It was the Jones family kitchen in London, was it? I don't remember why we went there. What was the reason we went there? Like, did somebody recommend it or something? I remember you just ordered a stupid amount of Chateaubriand. It was ridiculous. Uh, you're a sub. Yeah, you can post links. Subs can post links. I don't remember what I had from that place. Holy shit. I said you can post links, not novels. Bloody Nora. What even is that link? Fuck that. I ain't drinking that shit. No way. Can you just do it in like a Giazzo or something? Sod that. Put all the extra shit in that link. I ain't clicking that. No way. No way. That probably relinquishes my entire house and everything I own to Instagram. No way. I ain't clicking that shit. Look at all that extra stuff in that. No way. I'll uh, I'll wait for somebody to send like a gazo of it or something. Relink it with a shorter link doesn't change anything. So if I remove that and put all of this one over. Wait, does it line up with this side? Wait, 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 wait. Does this line up on the inside? Okay, that does. So it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Okay, cool. So if we just remove this, it'll be fine. Thank you, Panzer. And Imp. Thank you, guys. Yeah, that looks phenomenal. That's a bit of me. That's a bit of me. Hmm. Wasn't that like something? I can't remember what you paid for it as well. It was silly money. It was, I think it was like 160 pounds. Like ridiculous. Uh, I don't know why I'm removing this. This has to be brown terracotta. I think it was about 160 pound. I remember it being. He's having a heart attack just thinking about it. Like, oh, fucking hell, Rupert. Think I've got that kind of money? No, man. Ooh. Not paying it. But I have an enormous amount of respect for anybody that can go through life without eating 
meat. I just don't understand it. I, I wish I had that sort of mental resilience to resist, but I just don't. But I just don't. It's just too good. It's just far too good. I couldn't live without eating meat. It's just so good. It's not worth it. Oh, this is going to ruin my hill I made down here as well. We have a vegan at work and our life just doesn't look fun. I mean, I, I get that, you know, people have their morals and stuff and blah, 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 whatever. That's totally fine. But I just don't understand how I just, oh. It's just so good. So good. Um, no totem? Nah, I don't use totems. Uh, this leg is one too big. Because pass button's an idiot. Made it wrong. Which grandstands about all the time. Yeah, I see how that pisses me off. You know. Nobody cares. That is that is the bottom of all of it, really. Is no one gives a fuck. Eat what you want to eat. Do what you want to do. It's not for me. Don't force it onto me. But I don't understand it. Fair play to you for being able to do it. I'm not going. To. In fact, Don, if they were that annoying about it, I would deliberately go out to my local store by two steaks just to offset the impact she thinks she's having. <laughs> oh, God. I'm like, ah, this dinner last night. If she was being really annoying about it. Instead of having one steak for dinner, I had two. Just to offset the impact she was making. <laughs> That's so petty. Hey, if you want to grandstand and force that shit into me, and I don't want to hear it, I don't care, I'm happy for you, but you keep banging on about it, then I'll go to that level of pettiness. I have no shame. Uh, no, completely. I honestly, I don't care. I really don't. Neither does anybody. I don't think. It's not even just me. I don't think anyone gives a fuck. If you want to be vegan, vegetarian, my sister's a vegetarian. She doesn't blart on about it. She doesn't care. She just lives her life. Good for her. Good for her. Not my personal choice of life, but. She cracked on, she's happy, so there you go. Mm -mm -mm. Although, I'm going to give a little bit of credit here to the vegans and stuff. Greg's vegan sausage rolls are actually fire. I don't know how many people here have ever had them, but a Greg's vegan sausage roll slaps, and I will, I will, I will defend those happily. They are good. So I can't have the other ones because they've got milk in, which I still do eat them occasionally anyway, just because it's worth it. But Greg's sausage rolls, the vegan ones, are actually fire. Um, and to be fair, I had a meal on a flight back from Australia once, which was like noodles and tofu or something like that. And I'd never had tofu before, but it was insane. And it was a, it was a vegan meal because I couldn't do like just no non-dairy. It was like tofu, which I'd never had. And that was banging as well. So... There are good alternatives to that sort of shit nowadays. Whoa! Sleeping. What? There's mobs there, Mike. Run away!
God. I honestly can't tell you how badly I want a fucking steak right now. There's a temptation to go out and just do a steak week. It's so real. I want to do a steak week. Go and buy like 10 steaks from Tesco. It costs you like 30 quid. And just live on steak for a week. Cause it's that good. One sec, there's like 30 bucks. Really? What the hell? Fuck that. Thirty. I said 30 pounds for 10, not one. Fuck that. I wouldn't be paying 30 pounds for one. No way. Not unless I was in a restaurant and it was being cooked for me. No chance. No chance. Kind of low quality steaks you buy. Mate, Tesco had a deal on. You could get two ribeyes for like £6.75. And like, there was like, not these thin, horrible things, like thick, like steaks. I was like, yeah, done. Done. I know it's not going to be to the level of like the butchers, but for that kind of price, two 300 gram ribeyes for six quid. Happy days. That is a done deal. I'll be real, I'm a I'm fillet gang. I mean,. I just feel it's nice, but you, fat is fat is the flavour of the steak. Like fat is everything. That's that's where all the goodness is. And when you have a ribeye, it's all like marbled through the whole thing. So if you bite into it, it's just like oh. And it just it just explodes with flavour. What's your preferred way of making steak at home? Butter or oil? So, I'll heat a pan hot, like piping hot, and then I'll quickly dash of oil, steak straight in, right? That gets you sear, right? Sear is very important. Need that sear straight away. And then afterwards, I'll add the butter in. And the reason why I do that and do the oil first and then the butter is because it stops the butter from burning. You don't want the butter to burn. You want it to infuse the steak, not burn. So, it stops the butter from burning. Then you crush clove of garlic, get it in there. You can rub it on top of the steaks if you want to. Get it in there bit of thyme in there as well bang and then you create this like garlicky buttery oil that's not burning it's all just goodness and you got like a spoon and you sort of uh tilt the pan slightly and use your spoon and just put that goodness all over the steaks and you just make the most unreal steak man it's so good shout out to gordon ramsay who taught me that on his uh, little video it's just ah oh, it's phenomenal phenomenal okay we fixed buttons Pass buttons issue. That's all solved. So I'd recommend you do the exact thing because it is—it's just incredible. Um, basing. That's it. Basing is the word I'm looking for. It sounds fantastic. It is fantastic. Honestly, it changed my whole life. Minute and a half each side. Thick cut of steak. No, minute and a half or was it three minutes each side? I can't remember. Might be three minutes each side. Three minutes each side. A nice thick cut of steak and you'll just get that nice perfect medium cook. It's just beautiful. Medium, medium rare cook. Lovely. Um, that'll be 100 bits, Brock. Pay the file and do the time. Get him out of here, months. Uh, Nerda Porter looks great, Mac. It's over. You can't, can't see it behind the cow. When we get to the top, it will come into view here. Uh, hold on. Let me just quickly do this. Um, well, this is going to go all the way along. Covers what I've already done and an extra one. Which oil did I say it was? I use, uh, I think it's rapeseed oil. Is it rapeseed oil? I think it's rapeseed oil. And, uh, yeah, boom, straight in. But you have, you can't put the oil in first. You, it's got to be, as soon as you put the steak in, oil, bang, steak straight on top. Else the pan cools down too much. You don't get that sear. Gordon does that a lot. So you got to make sure you do that. I 
think it's rapes, you know. Now I'm, now I'm second guessing it. Now I'm second guessing it. Um. No, it definitely is. It definitely is. No, I, 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 it's definitely rape scene. Definitely is. Rape scene does need a rebrand. No, it doesn't. All people can just not be sensitive and be intelligent enough to distinguish between one that's a horrible crime and one that's just a seed. Um. So this was stowed, we put it as. Interesting. Um. Sure, we'll do this with stone here real quick. He's human. I am, because I hate woke bollocks. It just, it's just so annoying. You pissed me off, Robert. Congratulations. Uh... Is this? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's one, two, three. So it'd be three, three, okay. Three. Now, it should be a stone here, but I don't have any stones. So we're just going to skip that for a second. Stone, stone, stone. This, this. It is. We have loads of them around me. Just these bright yellow fields. They are uh, they are nice to see. Although, they suck for someone like me that just gets wrecked by hay fever every year. Uh, this is the nether portal thing for whoever it was that asked. I think Mac asked. Here it is, ma'am. This is what we came up with. This is what we came up with. It's not bad. I quite like it. I didn't know you'd be able to see farmland considering you live in a castle. Don't live in a castle. Robert, you, you often forget I live in the outskirts of Cambridge. Not central Cambridge. I don't live in Cambridge. I live in the outskirts where the scum live, okay? I am part of the scum, and I'm proud of it as well. Kitty cat, 90 months, dear lord. That is 10 babies. Ooh, the big 90. 10 babies. Ah, just squeeze another one out. Let us know what you'd like to, uh, to call it. Granola is very carcinogenic. Oh, but everything gives you cancer nowadays, mate. Just enjoy your life. You know what I mean? Just enjoy your life. Bollocks to all that shit. Uh, there we go. And then this is going to be two. Oh, God. Wait. Tits. Hold on. It's only this one, it's fine. No, we're fine. Everything's under control. Nobody panic. It's all fixed. Wait, what did Kaylee say? Last night I applied for a job, and now about 16 hours later, we decided we've evaluated your grant and tried to get others with more experience. Yeah, it can be rough getting a job nowadays, unfortunately. However, keep persisting, Kaylee. It'll all be okay. It'll all be okay. Life beats you up a little bit from time to time. But you will be rewarded for your patience. And determination. Um, so we decided just to go with this for that. That's fine. Um... Hey, 
Jamie, you can't run the Just Don't Stress command today because literally earlier on you were stressing about parking at an event that you're not even going to. <laughs> you were stressing about the cost of parking for an event you're not even attending. Uh... I do security at a medical office, uh, and I'm at work now. Easiest job ever. Can't argue with that, mate. Oh, there's a little nibble there as well. Just a little one. Just a little nib nib. Beautiful. Beautiful. Um, one, two. There's two left. I've just built the complete wrong layer, by the way. Did I do all of this as well? Oh, shit. Um... Whoops. Ah, sure. Who cares? It's fine. Thought the fishing stream wasn't today. Whoa! Nibbles galore for maybe today. It's actually been a very successful day for Nibbles. Um... So we'll do three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. That's nine. So I'm going to do one, two, three. I think I need to revisit what a nibble actually is. Oh, and she's nibbled at the nibble that I said she nibbled on. Oh, it's beautiful. It's a double nibble, chat. Do, 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 double nibble, nibble, nibble. That was beautiful. Getting a nibble at the nibble is that—that that is always a, a hell of an achievement. That's not a nibble. Oh! Too easy today, boys. It's far too easy. Nibbling almonds. I don't mind almonds, but I wouldn't just eat them straight. Wait, the cows don't have buttholes in this game. They actually don't. Oh my god, poor cow. Doesn't have a butthole. We should totally give it a butthole. Almonds are B tier. I've got to just... Uh, to eat straight, yeah, they're not up there. Pistachio is the number one for eating straight, followed by cashews. But the thing with almonds is when you put them in things, they're amazing. Like you whack them in like a cherry bake well. Oh, fantastic. Blend them up. Make marzipan. Oh, God. It's so good. You're mad, cashews are clear. No, pistachios on top, man. Robert, cashews are such like a childish fucking nut. Just like, eat a proper one, mate. Like, man up. You're scared of a nut. Are you scared of a nut? Is it gonna kill you? No. <laughs> oh, I eat pistachio because it sounds fancy. <laughs> No, it's just a superior nut in every way. You get to crack it open. The taste is way better. I don't think I've ever had a macadamia, Jared. Uh, have you seen the guy on TikTok who's working on the biggest Minecraft sandcastle? I have not. No, I have not. Uh, we have a serious wall crisis. I'm going to have to declare a serious emergency at some point here. Plays on Xbox as well. There used to be a guy. And apparently something dodgy happened with him, but I don't know what the dodgy thing was. But he used to come in here a lot. And I can't remember what his name is, but it came with S. It was like slime something. 
It was like slime something. He used to come in here. Like, he used to do... He used to play console, and he had massive, massive builds. Because he did all on console. I can't remember his name. Slim something? Slime something? But he used to do these humongous builds on uh, on Minecraft. And they were so cool. It was all done on console. Something dodgy happened with him. I can't remember what it was, though. It's not like Minecraft streamers have a, a reputation for that. Okay. I don't actually know what a macadamia is. If you'd asked me what, if you'd asked me before, what is that? If we weren't talking about nuts, I would have said it's a place. But that'd be me getting confused with um, Macedonia. <laughs> that'd be me getting confused with North Macedonia. Um, signs? No, it wasn't that. It was. Um, I don't know what his name was. I can't remember. But he made some cool Mago builds. It's going to piss me off, that, actually. It's going to annoy me. In fact, now it has. It's just clicked in my head that it's pissed me off and I'm annoyed. Academia was a dance. In Academia. The Macarena dance is actually slightly, it's not great. I've decided. It's not that great. That song with Saturday Night is way better. It's like Saturday Night and I like the way you move. That's a way better dance when everyone does the little forward, back, side, clap bit. So sick. So sick. Pretty baby. It's body time and I'ma take you to the top. Something, something. Way better dance. The whitest wedding song is Mambo Number no. Five, the Macarena of Sweet Caroline. Cha Cha Slide is probably yeah trumps all of what Robert just said. Uh, I, I I think it trumps all of them. Mambo Number no. Five, I don't think should be included. Mambo Five, Mambo Number no. Five is a great song. Oh, YMCA is a huge one. I think it's got to be Cha Cha Slide is probably the whitest song. Yeah, it definitely is. Um, I will ban you forever, Mac, if you do. What you know that? No, I don't care. You can't. I'm not gonna look it up right now. You're better off sending it on Discord and I'll have a look after the stream. Fast food song. Oh, what McDonald's? McDonald's. Good take a chicken and a pizza. Huh? Yeah, that one. That uh, that's up there. That's up there. I think Cha Cha Slide is probably the whitest song. It, it, it's got to be up there. It's got to be up there. You and him should make an insane world. I, I don't know the guy, so you know. The, the, this is why I go to these events as well, because you meet all kinds of amazing creators that you can do cool projects with. Like... Some of the guys that you meet in Somnia are just absolutely awesome. They, they come from like different genres on Twitch, but you end up working together, becoming friends and stuff. It's brilliant. Mr. Greggles is probably the most recent example of that. What a great guy. Just got married yesterday. Such a sound guy to sit and have a beer with. Look forward to doing that. This is something. Summer of 69. Don't stop believing. Uh, the white oldies love those here. Summer 69 is a banger, though. Summer 69 is a, is, is a banger. I don't mind Don't Stop Believing either, but... I like Summer 69. 
Like when that song comes on, you just sort of have to sing it. Don't you? you can't just be like. You just hear the da da da. Got my first real six trick. It's, it's got to be dumb. Shock Kaz is an alky in places late at night where people are drunk singing. What a surprise to absolutely nobody. Which one is that? Summer of 69? What? Was well, the summer of 69? Me and some guys from school had a band of... You must know that song. Come on. Everyone knows that song. If you don't know that song, it's that's very poor from you. Brian Adams, indeed. Oh, white girl to answer my wine happily. <laughs> I'm, um, you know, I don't mind. I, I don't mind a little dance, but I'm more of a, I'm more of a two-step kind of guy. I like my little two-step, beer in hand, sort of two-stepping. You know, that'll do me. Doesn't require a lot of effort, but you sort of fit in with the vibe. You know, I'm not going to do all this crazy shit when people are going nuts, you know. Just a little two-step and a head bob. Does me. And you can, like, make it a little bit more dramatic if you want. But you just can't go wrong. You can't go wrong with it. Uh, oh, what a fucking disaster this is. Hey there, Delilah. True. And everyone thinks they're funny talking about vaginas during it. Hey there, Delilah. What's it like in your vagina? Let me know. That was like, ha, 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 ha. That's a vagina. That used to be a thing anyway in my school when it was, it was pretty tragic. Oh, come on, Eileen's up there. Do like come on, Eileen. Charge our slide has to be number one. It just does. I do like a bit of come on, Eileen, though. I don't think anyone doesn't like a bit of come on, Eileen. When Cha Cha Sly comes on, you think, for fuck's sake, all the all the attention seekers run to the dance floor, trying to get the attention of everybody else. Look what I can do, you know. And you just sit there like, fucking hell, here we go. And, uh, yeah. Whereas, come on, Eileen, I feel like that's someone ever, everything can, uh, everyone can get with, you know. Mm. But it's funny actually because a friend of mine went to a to a bar, and uh, he decided you know he's going to do the dance moves to all the different songs that came on. So uh, jump around came on, so he jumped around. They put on the twist. So they were doing the twist. And then they played Come On Island, and he got kicked out for that. Oh, God. What do you mean, boo? That's a beauty. Fuck off a lot of you. You're all wrong. You're all wrong. That's a beauty. You know it. Summer in Link's Night Wolf, you know this. Denied. Um, we need to do the top of a cow, but we'll figure that out next. I'd rather do the side first. You always put on that voice when a joke's gonna be a stinker. What do you mean? Bro, bro, I feel attacked, mate. I'm not very happy about it. You're gonna make me sub? I'm not making you do anything. But it's sub only links. Which is the reality of the situation. <laughs> 
aisle. I don't make the rules. This is a terrible image of the side of a cow, by the way. Fuck this. I'm going to make my own. Bits. Bits. What do you mean, Sonic? It's Pun Day Monday. I'm allowed one for free. Paying for your sake. I'm allowed one for free. Thank you for the tournament, bits, mate. I appreciate it. Uh, I don't, oh, I did resub. Thank you for the resub, mate. It's, uh, you haven't shared it yet. I'll, I'll let you share it, and then we can go from there. Um, also, we're nine subs away from 400, chat. Do you know that you're not located in the darkness? What? That is the wrong, that is the wrong bit to say. Well, if you are out there and you're not located in the darkness, smash the follow button. I'd love you to come and hang out here sometime. And, uh, if you are sat a prime sub, you're not using it. Make sure you use it. It's got to be used. It's got to be used. Night Wolf. Thank you so much, Happy mate. Happy now. Four pounds. Four of the finest pounds, Night Wolf. Which I'm incredibly appreciative of. Thank you very much. I have an image of a cow now. It's worth it. How are you, Dark Hero? There goes my hero. Watch him as he goes. Emotional song. Emotional song. What a tune that is, it really is. Love it for Foo Fighters. That's one of the only Foo Fighters songs I can play on guitar, and it's so much fun to play. When you get to that chorus, it's just... It's so good. Good fun to play. Uh, right, so this is above the leg. So this is the bottom leg. This is above the leg. We'll ignore this because it's part of the front bit. It doesn't actually say that's here on this cow, but we'll use the different image we shouldn't have. Welcome to the whole guitar phase, you're over it. No, I still play from time to time. I've only picked it up a couple times this year. I've not had time to play this year. The problem with guitar is you play it and you get in the zone of it. You want to sit here for hours and play it. You can't, I can't do that at the moment. I've got too much going on, but I still love playing. It's good fun. Still got all my guitars. I'm thinking of selling a couple of them, but it's so hard to let go of them because I love all of them in their own way. Um, but I still jam for time to time. Uh... Right. So the only one here that's going to be different is this. Ibanez. I have an Ibanez. An Ibanez RG something. I can't remember what the numbers are for. It. I got that for a steal. That's a £700 guitar. I got it for £250. So, like, barely used on Facebook Marketplace. I was gassed. I was gassed. The pickups alone are worth the money that's in it. Let alone the rest of the guitar with all the fucking abalone and shit in it. All the sea snails that have been murdered to go into that guitar. I still am beggar into it. I just don't have time to play as much. So that's two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it's seven total. So that's two, three, four, five, Six, seven. So it should be one, two, one, three, one, two, three. That doesn't add up. Why does this not add up? This is one over. Is that two pixels? That's definitely two pixels in front of the leg, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Which is what I did. Why is my cow too long? We should have used the actual default cow image from the start. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I'm one short, that's why. Eight. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. How stupid is she? Uh, that's my mum. Can't believe I was made to sub, then my stream froze for long enough for me to miss. Everything until the topic was changed, and I don't get any payoff, and I don't even get a block in the sub block. 
The block and the sub is your own fault, Matt Wolf. You cannot even remotely try and make me feel bad for that because you put yourself on the blacklist from your stupid suggestions. But I did say that I appreciate you subbing to the channel. I'm very grateful. You had plenty of warning. So I want you to open up your wallet. I want you to slide your victim card back in there because we won't be needing that. And get a grip, Nightwolf. Right. You deserve everything that's happened to you. Because we're very fair here. Firm but fair. And you deserve it. Um, I assume it's for the biggest milk farm ever. Well, it's going to be for beef. It's going to be for beef. We could technically put two little cows in the udders so you can go there and actually get buckets of milk out of the udders. That'd be quite cool. I didn't eat breakfast today because I'm a genius and I'm so hungry now. I'm paying the price. I'm paying the price for, for skipping breakfast. I made a stupid suggestion. I was bad with no chance to suggest why. No, no, no. You made multiple stupid suggestions, that will. Let's not bend the story to suit your narrative because that would be false. Let's tell the true narrative. You made multiple stupid suggestions across multiple different donations, which led to a perma blacklist from the sub floor. That's what happened. So if we're going to tell the, tr the story, let's tell the truth. Okay. I'm so hungry. Oh my god. I hate being hungry, man, but I need to be hungry because it means my body's going to be burning other things in my thing in my body for energy like fat. Like fats and sugars. Eat a Snickers. That would kill me. What the fuck is going on? Why are my stone blocks what is going on? That was weird. It's Johnny with a hundred biddies. Oh. The mic's not text speech. One second. Hi, Button. I know you love the Prince Harry, but I know you not. Let's start again. Hey, Button. I know you love the Prince Harry book clip. So here is a spice joke incoming. Ah, okay. That wasn't the joke. Okay, here we go. Looking forward to it. You see, apparently a bit of backstory for Johnny's uh, one of the day today. So here we go. Prepare yourselves, people. Prepare yourselves. This is your Johnny Pun warning. Johnny Pun warning going out. Sound the alarms. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm weird. I'm very weird. Here we go. We're all on the edge of our seats here, Johnny. I hope, I hope you're aware of that. We're all on the edge of our seats. Still on the edge of our seats. About to fall off the edge of our seats. No, that wasn't the joke. Here we go. Come on. Hey, Button. Hey. Went to my local library today to try and get a copy of Prince Harry's new book to download. The librarian asked me if I wanted the PDF file. I said no, that's his uncle. I like it. Not bad. Um, it's it's in the sevens. It's in the sevens for me. It's got to be a seven point five there. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Well done, Johnny. 
Deserve. Deserve today, mate. Deserve today. Yeah, I, I thoroughly enjoyed that one. So that's one. Oh, it's going to join up to that anyway. Uh, you don't have to know the name of the uncle to understand that. Basically, his uncle's a pedophile. That's pretty much it. I enjoyed it. 7.5 is well earned. I'm going to send that to the message so she'll kick off otherwise. One second. <laughs> she won't kick. I shouldn't say that. That makes her sound like a psycho. She, she's not going to kick off. One second. Uh. What? Oh, hang on. Uh. Uh, right, so we got here. This will come along. You didn't know that? Well, now you do. The more you know. You have been educated by the chat. Uh, side note, thank you so much for being here, chat. If you're new out there, you haven't done so many, make sure you smash the follow button. We'd love you to come and hang out again sometime. We are live here literally every single day. Well, mostly. Mostly every single day. We were here seven days in a row last week, by the way. Shout out for that chat. I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, that's it for all of that. So it's just going to be brown on both sides of that. Then it goes up into the last little white patch. Cool. Uh, let's get the shit out of the ender chest. This stuff's doing my head in. Let's get rid of this. Some good progress on this cow so far today, by the way. The cow is looking good. We need a name for the cow. This is a tribute to Mountain Cow from all those years ago, but we need an actual name for the cow. And we're not going to know until we finish it because you can't. It's like having a baby. You might have names planned, but until you actually see the baby, like, you know, you, you can't actually, like, really name it. You know what I mean? If you have a kid, like, and you want to call it. Dave, and then it comes out, and it doesn't look like a Dave, and it can't be Dave, you know what I mean? Man, your head is huge. The fuck? What do you mean my head is huge? That's me. <laughs> Hi, buddy. How are you? Nice to see you, lovely. I love you too. I love you more. How about that? How about that? Um, it's got to be a billboard. I mean, I have, I've got a pretty big forehead, to be fair. Is it a five head? No, it's not a five head. It's not a five head. It's not a five head. Not quite. Your head isn't that big. I have a large brain here to process huge amounts of insane knowledge. There you go. How about that? You have a sick... No, you don't. That is mean. Don't be mean to yourself. Man, if you mean to yourself again, I'm going to have no choice but to come over there. And make sure that you're not mean to yourself anymore. I'll tell you off. Uh, I need a couple more stacks of stone. I don't really have any. Single player. Yes. Yes, this is all single player. This is all single player. 
It will happen, buddy. Someday I'll be over there and we will hang out. I don't know when, but it will, okay? I know it's not overdue. You know it's not overdue. We will hang out and we'll have the best time. It'll be great fun. Uh... Do you not think the, the Chaos Floor looks kind of fire? No, it absolutely does. Oh, did Hot Rod choose his blocks for the floor? Shit. Um, let me check his messages. I don't know if he's still here. Uh, messages. Is this today? Is it Black Glazed Terracotta he wanted. We never did do those. God, scumbag buttons scamming the chat. Hold fire. Hold fire. <laughs> Update me. Well, I have to give you the whole spiel um, in messages, Maddie. We're overdue a chat anyway, so. I'll message you later, more. I'll, I'll give you the full rundown. Amy Milko. Wow, that's mean. Yeah, I'm doing good. Thank you, Maddie. I hope you're doing well as well. Yeah, I don't know if we have any black glazed terracotta. I made more, but. Well, there's four. Well, that's not enough, is it? We'll have to make some more. Thank you, Maddie. That's very kind. That's very kind. Yeah, I'll give you the full spiel in a... Uh, in messages. We're long overdue a chat anyway. Not concrete button, you moron. Terracotta. Terracotta. Do I even have any? I do. We totally do. Um, ink sack. Good job. Pass button. Kept that because he knew it would come in handy. Ah, oh, thank you, Maddie. That's very kind of you. Hopefully, everything in your uh, love life is going well as well. Hopefully, it's all going well and uh, you're being treated as you deserve. Which obviously, like, I just lost my train of thought mid thought. I don't. What the fuck? What was I talking about? <laughs> oh, I hope you're treated as a princess like you deserve, buddy. There you go. I completely lost my train of thought then. And if not, I'll be fucking fuming. I'll be straight over there. Do you have a mini map mod or like waypoints mod? Uh, I don't use. No, there's no mods in this. This is just full single player. Full single player. There's seven. We need three more. Yeah, vanilla. The only mod in it is Optifine, and that's just so we can use the text pack. Uh, it's been good. We have his son for the next two weeks. We have two toddlers right now. Um, just celebrating his son's third birthday. I'm drained. Oh, I bet. I bet. You got this, though, Maddie. You got this. Powering forwards. Powering forwards. All right, let's get these in for Hot Rod. We're really going to struggle to separate these. This is going to become like a Hot Rod section. One. Two. Three. No, there's already one next to it. Can't go there. Uh, same here. Fuck. Four. Five. Six. Let's put a couple under the chest here before we move these soon. Seven, eight. Nine. Ten. Amy, Nick, Amy Milko would go, moo, man. Oh, stressed. There's no milk coming out. Oh, fuck sakes. My house is so lately, so loud lately, I just look at the boys like this, constantly. No peace quiet anymore, Maddie. That's what you signed up for. That's what you signed up for. <laughs> Cowzilla Cowmageddon. <laughs> Megan the Mega Cow. <laughs> I don't know why the body looks thin. I feel like the body should be thick, and it's not. I don't know, we'll see. It's all proportional, but... It's I think it might just be the angle you look at it. Yeah, like that looks fine. 
You think you need a vacation? Well, I know a very nice little place to go on holiday where your friend may or may not live, and I'm totally not biased towards. Time for a UK trip. I mean, that would be... I don't know, actually. I can't say that. I was going to say it'd be a wasted trip, but I had a friend of mine come over, uh, like, end of last year sort of time, and I went out with her, and she absolutely loved the UK. I take it all for granted, because London's just, like, there. But, yeah. It's, uh... I don't know. Maybe you'd enjoy it. As long as it's not freezing there. Well, it's getting warmer. Summer, the summer's coming. Slow redeem nothing. Wow. He's got the times redeem nothing, but not the times reply to my text. Mean. Enjoy your nothing, Kev. I think this summer's going to be hot in the UK. I've got a feeling. I got a feeling. Ooh uh, I've actually got to be a little bit careful here. Let's have a look at the shoulder of a cow real quick to see what it's like. In the sound of your heartbeat. Cow, look at me. It is all brown. Will you move, please? No, it's all brown except that corner piece, which we can make that grey, actually. That's fine. I think I'm going to plan a trip in uh, spring or summer. I have surgery on the 1st of July, so maybe I'll come after that. Oh, God. Hope you're okay, buddy. Please don't die on me or anything like that. That'd be great. Really appreciate it if you didn't do that. Okay. But why haven't you built anything out of Star Wars yet? Because Star Wars is one of the most overrated series of films in the world. You have to have your wisdom teeth removed, all four. Yeah, I mean, I've... Good luck with it, and I hope you... Some people are okay, but... I remember when Roxy had hers done, and I had to look after her. That, bless her, that looked fucking rough. So, hopefully yours is not like that. And, uh... I mean, once they're out, they're out, I guess. That's one way to look at it. That's one way to look at it. But yeah, it, it looked fucking brutal from what she had. Yeah. Make sure boyfriend is on hand to look after you because that Yeah, that was that was rough. I thought I was gonna have to have mine out, because I've had one come through at the back here. Which is fine, but it was starting to like move my teeth and now it's like stop. But uh, the other three, I've got no idea where they are. I'll probably have to add them out at some point. And I, I really don't want that. They haven't broken anything I had surgery, so I'm terrified. Do they knock you out for it? I think they do, don't they? Oh, hey, Rody. Hope you're doing well, mate. I think they knock you out for it. And what I can comment on that is... Go, being knocked out for surgery is one of the best things I ever did. It was fucking awesome. I loved every second of it. And that sounds really weird, I know, but you have to just trust me on this. It was one of the most amazing experiences. I would happily do it again tomorrow. Uh, like, you don't feel a thing. Even everything from the drip they put in your hand. That you, all I remember, right, so this is when I had my eye surgery like 10 years ago. Then I took my eye out, straightened all up, put it back in. Right, anyway. You like lay there and they like start putting the stuff in your arm. They're like, right, count to 10 for me. I was like, okay, sure. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> gone, right? But to, and I was gone for an hour and a half. Surgery was an hour and a half. I was out for an hour and a half. But to me, I blinked. And I know that's going to be hard to fathom, but I literally just went bang. I was in another room. It was, it was mental. It was so cool. So I like blinked. But like. It was a conscious blink. So I couldn't open my eyes when I came around first of all because I was so high on morphine. I had to use my finger to open my eye to look around. And I remember like, I blinked and someone was talking to me. All of a sudden, oh, my eyes were shut. I couldn't open my eyes. I was like, what's going on here? I look around. I looked up and I could see these bars on the windows. I thought I was in prison at first. So after a few seconds, I was like, right, I know where I am. But I like blinked. 
And it was, it was phenomenal. I blinked, but my eyes were shut. Someone started talking to me. I thought, what's going on? Oh shit, I'm in prison. No, I'm not. I'm fine. And an hour and a half had passed. And it was, it was one of the most amazing experiences ever. And I'd love to do it again. Yeah, please do, Maddie. I'd love to see it. it. It's, it's, I was all right, to be fair. Like I said, I just thought I was in prison. I was so relaxed. I, I was, I was chilling. Um, I knew exactly what I was doing. Because when I went to open my eyes, she was like, no, because it was this one that they'd done. But I knew, I knew I'd had surgery in that. And I just went like that and I'd look around what was going on. It was so good. If he shows stream, I will kill him. I won't do that. Yeah, I, I imagine the recovery for my eye surgery is probably a lot better than the recovery from having four wisdom teeth pulled because that shit, yeah, it don't look fun. It doesn't look fun. And there's a lot of blood and a lot of gauzes. But once it's done, it's done, right? Like, you don't have to ever worry about it again once it's done. So it's one of those. Any comment on whether this is still accurate? What on earth is this? Relax, but in prison. At least I can know if you go to jail, you'll be as calm as can be. Oh, yeah. Well, I, but I was aware that I hadn't done anything wrong. So I knew I, if I was in prison, I needed to figure out why I was in prison. I was very aware of what had happened. Like, and it was only a second or two later, and I was like, oh, I'm in hospital. Um, what is this from? This is from two years ago. Oh, I had a beard back then. Jeez. And I'm wearing this shirt. Oh, my God. This is fucked. Right, okay, let's carry on. Why do I look tanned? I must have come back from somewhere. Maybe Cro maybe ruler. this is after Croatia. Anyway. This thing is like as long as a ruler and about as wide as that. And it's like all orange and yellow and... It's got these bit too big fangs on the front of it. It's like, it's, mate, it's horrible. <laughs> Wait, what am I describing here? Long as a ruler. This thing is like as long as a ruler and about as wide as that. And it's like, like all orange and yellow and what was I describing? Long as a ruler, orange and yellow. It's got these bit too big fangs on the front of it. It's like it's, it's mate, it's horrible. And two fangs. On... Oh, I'm talking about that fucking um from uh, Brave Wilderness when he took a bite from the fucking centipede thing. Yeah, the the giant desert centipede. That thing. That's what I'm talking about. Holy shit. Yeah, that thing's fucked. That is something out of nightmares. Would not recommend you look up a giant desert centipede or watch that video of the agony that guy was in because it was, yeah, it's pretty crazy. I mean, it was all done for scientific purposes, but that guy was in pain. Like, holy shit. So this is wrong. Yeah, this bit here is completely wrong, whatever I've just done. Hey, Rallius, how are you, mate? Uh, right. Oh my god! And then. And then! Tier 2, that of your mind, 100. And 10. Been a minute. Month of runes. That's the last time, though. Thank you very much. Welcome back. Erin! Three days to go. Are you excited? Oh, what if Matt replied? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I asked Matt what was wrong, so I just see his tweet. I'm not going to read the message because I haven't read it myself yet. But it starts with, oh, God, let me begin. <laughs> God. Oh. Um. You're very excited? Aaron, I need to try and remember to pat, uh, pat my United top. I will bring my United top for the game on uh, Saturday. 
I need to remember to pack it. I'm very excited. I don't think I've ever been this excited for an insomnia. Um, screenshots. Let me just delete all the random shit that I've just done for you. Yeah. yeah, I don't know if I've ever been so excited for an insomnia. I'm not sure why. I just think about this one. It's going to be amazing. I would, yeah, please. That'd be great. If you can nag me to make sure I pack it. If you can nag me to make sure I pack it, that'd be fantastic. How was the game against Brazil? Amazing. Absolutely amazing. I didn't go to watch England. I wasn't too bothered about that. I've seen England many times. I went to watch Brazil. And even though it was a, a, a weaker sort of Brazil team, Vinny Jr. was the main, main player I wanted to see. And holy fucking shit. What a player. Like, that guy is just immense. Absolutely immense. Um, yeah, it was, all, it was awesome to watch. Awesome to watch. Um, thank you, Aaron. How are you, though? Hope you're doing okay. Thank you again for the 110 months. That was tier two out of your mind. You get two blocks in the subfloor. Let us know what you'd like. We'll get that in the subfloor for you. Two block of of your choice. He's on a different... Oh, it was just insane. Absolutely insane. We deserve to lose. We played like shit. Southgate sucks. Needs to be, needs to be sacked. But the game itself was... Uh, yeah, it was that was mega. Absolutely mega. Um, right. We're going to try and do the top of this here. I don't know. The back of the cow will just do brown. I don't think it really matters. Oh, no. We can't because there's actually color on the back of it. Last shift today before one holiday. Oh, you've got tomorrow in the off as well. Woo! Exciting. Yeah, I'm not doing too bad, eh? Life is, uh... Life's pretty good at the moment. I get blocks, there's so many. Correct. Correct. Uh... I'm quite excited today as well, chat. I'm not going to share this with the chat, even though they may not care. I'm uh, I'm going to do a gym session with my granddad today. We used to go to the gym every morning, like four years ago, before I went to Australia. We used to go every morning, four times a week. Four times a week in the morning, we'd go, we'd train together. And he's a, he's a bit of a unit. Like He's, he's not... I, there's a picture somewhere on my Twitter from 2019 of us. First time I lifted 100 kg. Yeah. He's a bit of a beast. And uh, we've not we've not trained together for years. And I said to him yesterday, I went to see him. I was like, come come to a session. We'll, have, we'll, do, we'll do whatever you want. And uh, he's like, all right, I'll come tomorrow. We'll do a shoulder session. So I hate shoulders, but I'm going to do it for him. Because it's going to be good fun. going to be good fun. My scroll wheel is being weird. And I don't know why. It's annoying. Isn't it nuts that I can remember that? Such t uh, tangential... Info. That's a big word, Robert. I don't like that word. It's too big for my liking. Wait! Sonic Robert's never heard. Lol. Lol. Um, right. Um, that was kind of toxic, actually. I don't know why I did that. Sorry, Robert. My bad. My bad. Okay, we've already got the top and bottom to do with this cow now. There we go. Make sure nothing spawns in the ears. I know. I don't understand either, Aaron. I'm not sure what it is. I don't know if it's because the likes of friends are going who don't usually do things like BYOC, like Imp, um, or just the, the that United are playing then, the... I don't know. I don't know what it is. It's just weird. There's just something about this is something that I'm just really excited for. I mean, I've been excited for all of them. Don't get me wrong, but for some reason, this one, I'm just like, I can't wait. Just go away, play some games with friends, casino, few drinks, lovely food. It's just gonna be great. Make a diamond saddle for the cow. I don't know about that one. Erin, you need to choose your blocks. Come on. Have you chosen your blocks? 
You have not. We need you to choose your box. Um, what a lovely statue of your mom. Ooh. Rough, man. That was kind of me. That was fucked up. Bro, don't fucking bro me, buddy. What the fuck's going on? This is your opportunity to make a decision, Aaron. Come on. You got this. Make a decision. Large dog. Ten beautiful months. Thank you so much, pal. Welcome. What a legend. Brew. should say brew. Brew, laddie. Oh, fuck. I've got the back of that cow's head. Seriously wrong. Uh, we can actually fi finish that right now. Come here. Let me, let me look at your head. One second. Stop moving! Stay there. No! So, we got grey, grey, grey stone. Right in the middle. You want red nether brick? Okay, that's one. Would you like two red nether brick? Or would you like... Something else? Uh, three, three. Oh, that's perfect. So then it was gray, gray, gray. Like so. Oh, no. Oh, it's fine. Who cares? Nobody cares. Actually, I care. Do you know what? I give a fuck. Pass button and his laziness is being removed. A red block for you. Oh, shit. Great seem to exist. True. True. You. <laughs> okay, maybe not. Maybe not. We're on the march to ten hogs of me. We're all going to Wembley. And we'll really shake them up when we win the FA Cup. Because you like to sit out of Grace for the team. Boom. 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 Incorrect, Rorip. Red nether brick and another bright red block. We'll see what we can do. Hang on, Aaron. I got you. One second. One second. Just bear with me. Oh, fire. Oh, God. That stretch was good, man. Mmm. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, where's this come from? I don't know where this came from. Whoops. I'll just uh, put this away. Must have just caught on my hand when I stretched out there. Uh, right. United will never be anything again without Fergie. I disagree. However, I do semi-agree. United will never do what they did with Fergie yet. Never. I don't, think, I don't think any club will ever do what Fergie did. Not even just United. I don't think any club will ever be able to do what Fergie did. I don't think the majority of every other club, even Liverpool fans and City fans, do admit it's Frank Fergie is the best manager of all time. What he achieved will never be repeated. It just won't. Need to head back to work. Have a good one. Uh, pick up the Reds. Fuck Liverpool. True. Have a good day at work, Aaron. Take care. And uh, I'll see you Thursday. If you're coming down Thursday. I assume Thursday. Why did I come back? Oh, Aaron's blocks. Red nether brick and something else.
Some respect on Mourinho. I'm, I'm a Mourinho fan. I like Mourinho. Got a lot of respect for Mourinho, but he's no Alex Ferguson. He's no Sir Alex, but Mourinho absolutely has my respect. What does red glazed terracotta look like? Uh, right, let's do one of these, two of these. Bye, Aaron. Boy, see you Thursday. I think we're getting there like 12, so we'll be about if you want to uh, come hang out. Uh, yeah, it's going to have to go over here, but it's no problem. Let's get it in. Boom. Look at that. Fantastic. And then... Uh, Red nether brick too. Ah, oh, there's already one there. Gotta move it. Gotta move it. Right there. There you go. There we go. You'll be there around 3.39. That's very specific. Fair enough. I'll see you at 3.39. <laughs> 3.30. That's no worries. Probably be pissed in a weather spoons by then, but we'll be there. Oh, yeah, because you're not. Because Kev's not going. You're not going with him this time. I forgot about that. Oh, well, how would we get there, Aaron? Safe travels. Slow's not going. No. He basically said he can't be asked. That's basically what he said. He said, I can, I can afford it, but I can't be bothered. That's essentially what he said. But then we went to London last week with me, him, and Matt, and he was like, I'm kind of sad I'm not going now. He's definitely going to have FOMO. I then had the cheek to say, oh, I'll be in Birmingham at some point anyway over the weekend because I've got a meeting there. So if you want to come say hi, you can. Absolutely fucking not. You think I want to go out of my way to travel from the edges of Birmingham to go into Birmingham? To meet you. Absolutely not. Not happening. Sorry, Kev. I made that very clear. A direct train from here to... But, oh, so you're going straight to there. Oh, that's easy. Happy days. Happy days. This is CO2 big. Yeah, I know. That's literally what it is. I, I did ask him, have you, has your love for me gone now? And he said yes. It was very sad. Broke my heart a little bit, actually. Okay, bye everybody. Bye 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 Go back four hours and ten minutes is when we'll be here tomorrow. Um, make sure you follow all the socials. Follow the Twitters for updates when the stream goes live. Instagram if you're interested in my personal life. Um, YouTube extra content you may have missed. And the VODs channel for everything from day one of season two. All the way to where we are in this game uh, in season three. So uh, Follow all that sort of stuff. Uh, I love you all and we will see you all then. Take care. Stay awesome. Uh, is anyone live to say hi to? Let's have a look. Stay awesome. Um, is anybody around to go and say hello to? Ah, oh, my boy Happy Chef. Let's continue the positive vibes and go over to see Happy Chef. He's uh, cooking up some magic of some sort. He makes some unreal food. If you've ever checked the Food Porn channel in Discord, you'll see some of the insane creations this man makes. Very good friend of the channel. Uh, copy this raid message. Go over and say hi to my boy. He's all over there. And uh, we will see you all uh, all then. So uh, take care. Stay safe. Stay awesome. Uh, I won't be saying that, Pulamese. So not going to happen. Um, so yeah, go say hi to my boy, Happy Chef. And we'll see you all tomorrow. Take care, everybody. Peace out. Bye, chat. <laughs>